bell which we'll bring in for you in a little bit and uh, thank you so much for You're today welcome. and Lovely delving today. into leather for us no where are you on with us next though um i think it may be the eighth I can't remember. Okay, we'll keep soon, soon. It's a morning show. By the way, just to let you know, Vikings, we've all had a little look. Have you? No. What do you mean no? No, you've got strange oh. taste, Gemma Crow. Um, uh -huh. <laughs> thank you so much for joining me this afternoon and the gorgeous Gemma Crow. Tomorrow I am joined for a first full day. It's me and Frankie from us. We'll see. To the left, hurt, hurt to the right, hurt. <laughs> ah, give me a J. Give me a J. Give me an E. Give me a W. Give me an E. <laughs> give me an L. I'm trying to finish that word. Give me another L. An E, an R, and a Y. Plus a maker, jewelry maker. Bet you didn't know how today's show was going to start out, did I? I bet you didn't think it was going to start out like that, did you? Honestly, have I said anything intelligible yet? I don't think I have. <laughs> it's one of those days. One of those days. Tell you what. Check it out. Oh! It's a wee Scotty dog. Uh, Mug, I'm drinking my tea out of. Isn't it gorgeous? Isn't it beautiful? Little West Highland Terrier. We should have had it on the show the other day when we had Maggie with us, even though she doesn't live in Scotland, but she is Scottish. That would have been lovely. We were looking for another, um, another doggy canine uh, mug um, for you, Janet, but I'm afraid we couldn't find any more. Mm, no. What have you got on your mug? Um, I've got flowers on mine. Pretty. Black flowers. Black flowers, yeah. Black! Black flowers. <laughs> Pretty black Aww. flowers. How you doing? Yeah, I'm good. 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 Very nice cup of tea that, Cla that our Chloe's made. Tea's cracking. Nice, tea. considering she doesn't drink hot drinks. There we go. Chloe is with us today. She is head of production um, on Jewelry Maker, but she's today. She is our floor manager. Chloe, do you want to come in and give us a wave? Come on, come on, darling. Part of the team. Part of the team today. Come on, here we go. You and job. Is. I know the camera puts ten pounds on. You are heavily pregnant, though. So look at that, no, no, baby. No, no. You're gonna give us a wave. <laughs> <laughs> Gorgeous, Chloe. We got Chloe with us today. Ollie, come on, give me, give me some, give me some. Come on, yeah. Ollie's with us today. Uh, we've got Dion with us. Come on, Dion. She's looking sexy today. I tell you what. Ooh, that was like a slow reveal rather than a quick flash. I like that. I like that. We've got the gorgeous, the lovely Kerry with us today. He's on cameras. How you doing, darling? She's got little flowers in her hair, looking like a gorgeous maid Marion again. Pretty cute. And I got my mug. It's all I need. How are you this morning? How are you doing this morning? I've had loads of fruit this morning. Ooh. No, I woke up and drank ten, uh, ten pints, two pints of water. Very thirsty this morning. Ooh. Very thirsty this morning. You didn't need to know that anyway. It was a good story. The moral of the story is never uh, tell a story, Carol, because they're all boring. Right, how are you doing today? Today's texting is absolutely amazing. We want to know because it's payday. At last, it's payday. This has been the longest month ever, hasn't it? Today, finally, yes, it's payday. Do text us today. We'd love to hear from you because our texting subject is brilliant. Impulse buys, everyone. What have you bought and then regretted? What have you bought then regretted? Impulse buys. Do text us today. Our text number is 60777. Start your text with the word James Studio. Your name, maybe where you're from. Impulse buys and uh, <laughs> normal network charges apply. Um, I'm Carol, by the way. I'm with you for the next four hours. And this is our lovely Janet. She's with you for four hours as well. We've got loads of wire because Janet's on the show today. 
The three kits are absolutely amazing. Yeah. You've actually said they're your best kits yet, haven't they're you? They're my favourite kits so really? far. They were just lush to work with. Yeah. They were amazing. The price points for all three kits, the prices are just out of this world. They're incredible. They're all under £30. They're absolutely awesome, awesome, awesome. Right, OK. Early bird special, everyone. Here we go. It's called Twist and Shout. Yeah. Good song there. Come on, let's twist again. Like we did last summer. Yeah, let's twist again, like we did last year. Do you remember when? Okay, that is enough. <laughs> that is just enough of that. Full of beans today. Sorry. Sorry. Well, it's better than being half asleep, isn't it? Half asleep at the desk, slumped over the desk. Uh, we've got two lots of twisted wire here, magenta and purple. Um, the great thing about our twisted wire is that you've got two wires twisted together. So you get this gorgeous kind of, um, this beautiful contrasting color going all the way through, uh, all the way through your wire here. 10 meters in each spool here. You're gonna be getting 10 meters of your 0.4 millimeter gauge wire, which essentially means you're gonna be getting two 0.4 millimeter gauge wires twisted together. So really the equivalent of about a 0.8 millimeter gauge wire. You're then gonna be getting 10 meters of one millimeter gauge wire. So that's two lots of your one mil gauge wire twisted together as well. Um, purple and magenta, purple and magenta. Absolutely sensational. There are loads and loads and loads of ways in which you can use this. Um, loads of our guest designers um, love working with these twisted wire qualities. In fact, there's a, an example there. That's gorgeous. Beautiful flowers, some gemstones in the center there using our gorgeous twisted wire. Who made that? Gemma Crow. Gemma Crow made that gorgeous flower. It's absolutely stunning, really, really beautiful. Have we got any of Janet's pieces? Ooh. Oh yeah. They're lovely, Janet. I with like that those. Colour, colour wire as well. It is with this colour. Yeah. What's it like to work with? Um, it's fabulous. It is really, really good. Um, I, lo I love twisted wire. Um, and it's, it's just amazing. And especially having the two different colours as well. You mm. get a really beautiful effect. And those two colours together, I've worked with those, are beautiful. You can untwist it as well, can't you? You can, I've done that as well. Um, and use that. Um, I did a tree of life, so I actually untwisted them for the branches. We oh. had the different, different colours. So that was, um, oh, and that one as well. Oh, <laughs> making so. a blush. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, it's fabulous to work with. There's two lots of wire here, two 10 meter spools that you're gonna be getting here. We want to be your one-stop shop for everything jewelry maker related, for everything wire related and gemstone related, for everything dog mug related as well. We want to be absolutely your one-stop shop. Get involved with jewelry maker in two different ways, either by giving us a call on our free phone number, which is 0800 644 or get involved on our website, which is jewelrymaker.com. Would you like to see your amazing price point? Because it is an early bird special. You are gonna be getting an amazing price point. Oh yeah, 20 meters of wire, £7.95p. <gasps> Absolutely superb. Pick up the phone, dial, give us a call. You've got a 30 day money back guarantee with everything you get from Jewelry Maker. Also, you're only paying one lot of P and P. Two pounds 95 P. Two, P and P. For the entire day. That's for absolutely everything. That's from 9 a.m. till 9 p.m. I think that's amazing. There are very few other companies out there that would dare offer not only one P and P for the entire day, but a P and P that's so low. 295p and p and believe you and i some of the parcels which um a lot of you order because they contain things like wire tools kits um and, and all the incredible deals that we've got coming up today those parcels can be really really heavy we don't penalize you for that it's just 295p and p per order if you do want to multi-buy anything on today's show it's simple to do that either by giving us a call on our free phone number speaking to the call center and saying hey can i get two lots of that wire please and they'll say yeah absolutely we'll add two to your order um, or if you're going to be buying off our website, then you just alter the quantity that goes into your basket and you can come in and get two or three or four lots of this. Really, really, really fantastic. $7.95 for two lots of wire. 10 meter spools, um, 10 meters in your one mil gauge wire. So that's two lots of one mil gauge wire twisted together and 10 meters in your 0.4 millimeter gauge wires as well. I wonder if I could just untwist this. What well, you've got to remember as well, there's 20 meters there. Yeah. But if you wanted to create that, you would need 40 meters of wire because they're twisted. Ah! So if you were buying two separate lots of wire and twisting them, you would need double the amount because there's two lots together. So from, a, from a, a po that point of view, you've got to think about that as well. Just thought I'd throw that in. They're all taking the mickey out of me saying, yes, Carol, we can see you working that out in your head. Yes, the, <laughs> yes. can you see the mice kind of running around <laughs> in the wheel in there? Uh, uh. <coughs> Ah, yeah. 
you would need 40 meters of wire you're yeah. quite right Janet and I think sort of um, having your own wire and twisting them is fabulous mm -hmm. um, having this is fabulous it just depends what you want to do if, if you're making to sell then th this is great because it's much easier yeah it's much easier time wise you're not spending as much time actually on individual pieces so yeah, that can reflect in, in the, your price point isn't it just so I like that it's amazing well done I've got tons and tons and tons of you still coming through for this absolutely wonderful deals absolutely incredible well done uh, we've got some texts in today oh no it's going to unravel there we go uh, Maureen from London Carol I thought that was a new tool only to find it's a cup how addict oh yeah sorry yeah this is our newest tool to jewelry maker this is called the um, i don't know what 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 someone just take carol your mug is a scotty not a westy uh carry on being not so is it the scotty dog called a west highland terrier I thought a Scotty dog was a West Highland Terrier. I don't know. Is a Scotty black and a West Highland Terrier white? No, I don't, I don't think so. Oh, I don't know. Have I just offended the entire nation? I'm sorry if I have. There's dogs sitting at home going, oh, actually, Carol, <laughs> I am a West Highland Terrier. I'm not a Scotty dog. Can you imagine a dog sitting in front of the TV saying that? It's got no head, so it's, uh, theoretically, I, I can call it whatever I like. <laughs> um, they call it the, uh, the Anne Boleyn of the dog world, I like that. My impulse buys are all jam related, but never regretted. Do you know what? I love you for saying that. That's awesome. Thank you very much for that. Thank you very much for that. Christine from Kent. Carol, worst impulse buy, 1930s plaster cast three foot sculpture of a little girl <laughs> ooh, dancing around a hat in garish colours at a steam rally. Junk stall. I love the description of that. A little girl dancing around a hat <laughs> at a steam rally junk stall. <laughs> How much was it? Does sound a bit like the beginning of a horror story. She bought it at a junk fair. She put it in. She put it on her mantelpiece. Then, then, <laughs> then it answered back. <laughs> the curse of the little girl dancing around the hat bought from a steam fair in cinemas now uh christine part two. Oh yes tell us more christine uh why uh why i was at the steam rally i don't know why i bought this piece of junk i don't know fell off the shelf when i was dusting it and smashed <gasps> didn't release a spirit releasing the spirit of the dancing girl christine's at home in a minute just dancing around a hat she doesn't know why <laughs> she's possessed <laughs> oh, that's not funny at all. That's horrible. <laughs> well, that's 95 for your early bird today. We can't do um, amusing voiceovers for the workshop room. There's no one in there. Hello? Hello? I'm locked in here. It's Liz Welsh from the other day. <laughs> Hello? Is she? Is that, is that Liz? Liz, is that you working here? They've locked me in here. I can't get out. <laughs> That's what happens to uh, guest designers when they don't behave themselves. <laughs> Ooh. We lock them in the workshop room. <laughs> <clears throat> Hello? Hello? You shut up in here! <laughs> oh, who's, who's that? <laughs> I don't know who said that. That looked like Chloe dancing around there, didn't it? Who was it? It was a porcelain doll dancing around the hat from a steam rally bought from a junk store by Christine. Oh, it's going to be one of those shows, isn't it? Could go anyway today, couldn't it, Janet? It could. I can see where it's going there. <laughs> and who says shopping telly's boring, hey? <laughs> Was that the strangest 13 minutes of television you've ever seen? Me too. <laughs> Fantastic. Right. Um, today's challenge is... I think we need to start challenging our guest designers with something outside their comfort zone. Which one, sorry? I think we need to start challenging our guest designers with things which are outside their comfort zone because Janet, this has got you written all over it. It's amazing, isn't it? We need to start challenging Janet maybe with some, maybe with this water bottle or something or maybe with a <laughs> plastic bag. Make something out of that. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, right, this is whatever I've got in my pocket. What have I got in my pocket? 
got nothing there. Actually, that wouldn't be a bad challenge, would you, to do something like that? I'd be up for in that. Your pocket. Well, it depends what you've got in your pocket. Uh, have I got anything in this pocket? Bit of a plastic seal. <laughs> that, that, <coughs> that's it. Oh, that's no that's all I have in there. That's what I took my uh, plastic cover off my mouthwash bottle this morning. Ew. And then <laughs> bought the plastic... What do you mean, uh? <laughs> and, then, and, then, and then took the plastic wrapping downstairs, I cleared it and put it all in the bin. The rock and roll lifestyle that I have, ladies and gentlemen. Anywho, right, this is much more exciting. These are gemstones. Gorgeous collection of cabochons. Now, there is another part to this challenge as well. Um, but let me start off by showing you this stunning cabochon that you're going to be getting here. Beautiful, gorgeous amethyst pear drop cabochon. Look at that, isn't that stunning? Absolutely gorgeous quality. Really, really beautiful. This is around about 25 by 18 millimeters in diameter. So actually, do you know what? You've got a perfect size for a pendant. You've got a perfect size to make that gorgeous ring out of it as well. Absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Just gorgeous. Um, you've also got this stunning um, um, uh, kind of textured quality within the gemstone as well, which is what you'd expect to get from an amethyst of this kind of size. To go with this, how about rose quartz? Beautiful oval of rose quartz here. Again, you're going to be getting that wonderful texture within the gemstone. You can really tell it's a genuine gemstone. You've got a gem here, which is the gemstone of friendship and partnerships. Absolutely gorgeous, beautiful quality there. So you're going to be getting an oval of rose quartz. Then you're going to be getting blue chalcedony, a gorgeous blue chalcedony kind of lily shaped flat bead, which has been carved. The drill hole, because the other gemstones don't have drill holes. These do though. The drill hole is through the center. Really, really fantastic quality gemstone. Look at how that's been carved. Can you see that? Yeah, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? You're going to be getting a large one and two small ones. I feel like, what's the name from Countdown? One big one and seven little ones. You know, when they're choosing the numbers. Rachel who? Rachel Riley. She's gorgeous, isn't she? And you're going to be getting two of these beautiful carved blue chalcedony lilies as well, both with drill holes through the center. There is another gemstone as well, which I absolutely love. And it is your gorgeous pear drop of mookite. Oh, it's natural, it's beautiful. An incredible genuine gemstone only from Australia. The most wonderful, wonderful quality. Maroons in there, custard colors, um, uh, yellows. Oh, look at that. Look how different that mookite is to the one I've got here. <clears throat> Isn't that interesting? And you might find that because all these gemstones are exactly that they are genuine gemstones they're not mass manufactured they're not mass produced they're not glass they're not plastic um glass and plastic obviously does have its place in uh, jewelry making uh, but here at uh jewelry maker we specialize in genuine gemstones absolutely 100 percent the quality here is just superb isn't it six genuine gemstone cabochons now we're going to give you the price for this there is another part to this challenge uh, which we're going to give to janet for six gorgeous cabochons this is your deal today under a tenner for all of these incredible genuine gemstones, for all six of these beautiful genuine gemstones. Stunning quality, aren't they just beautiful? Absolutely wonderful for six wonderful gems. Now with the cabochons, oh, sorry, I beg your pardon, with the, um, with the carved flowers, you've got, um, you've got the potential if you want to, to make a pendant and a pair of earrings out of these. I would advise multi-buying a bundle like this. Why? Okay, well, if you're going to be making something like earrings, if you want to make anything which you need two of, i.e. a pair of earrings, um, then or, or a pendant and a ring um, set, then I would advise getting two of these bundles, of course, because then you're going to be getting two amethysts, you're then going to be getting two rose quartz, two mookites, <coughs> and six beautiful um, uh, blue chalcedony uh, carved flowers. So really, really stunning. And look at the kind of size you're going to be getting here. So you've got this mookite here, which is around about, which is the biggest one. Lovely, just the right size for a massive, massive pendant. You've then got, now these are around about the same size, actually, these, the rose quartz and the, um, and the amethyst. Great for pendants, perfect for rings as well. Absolutely perfect for rings. Imagine that one in a ring. Oh, I like the thought of that. Yeah, why wrap that into a ring? That does bring us to our next part of our challenge, which of course is going to be wire. Um, so do add these to your order. 9.95 for six of these cabochons. And of course, three of them are these beautiful carved lily shaped blue calcedonies as well, which have got a drill hole through the center. You can see them there, they're absolutely beautiful, gorgeous translucent quality. Now, here is the next part of the challenge today. 
So 995 for your six genuine gemstones. Amazing, 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 amazing. And then this, believe it or not, is the second part of the challenge. Look, at all, is this all one bundle? It's absolutely amazing, look at this. All one bundle. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely amazing. You are gonna be getting 10 meters of 0.4 millimeter gauge wire. So great to do your um, final little twists and twirls with uh, to embellish your pieces of wire work. Not only that, but because it is 0.4 millimeter in gauge, you can twist two lots of it together. We've got the wire twister pliers coming up on today's show, which is really exciting. Um, you can twist two lots of this wire together instead of having a 0.4 millimeter gauge wire, you've then created effectively a 0.8 millimeter gauge wire. You're then gonna be getting 10 meters of um, 0.4 millimeter gauge navy blue colored copper wire. Love that combination, don't you? Navy blue and copper, or navy blue and kind of a rose gold color. You're then gonna be getting 10 meters of 0.6 millimeter gauge turquoise colored copper wire. Lovely. Then another 10 meters of 0.6 millimeter gauge silver colored copper wire. Then another 10 meters of 0.6 millimeter gauge fuchsia color copper wire. Woohoo! And then another 10 meters, this time 0.8 millimeter gauge wire, and it's turquoise and blue. So you're going to be getting, you're going to have the potential um, uh, to work with uh, two lots of 0.8 millimeter gauge wire twisted together. So that's really a 1.6 millimeter gauge wire, which is amazing. All those colors go together, don't they? I'd probably say I'd put all those colors together <coughs> with the fuchsia. I'd definitely go down that route, down that route. Actually, it does go with all of them. Do you know what stuff? They all go together, don't they? They really do, don't they? You're going to be getting 10, 20, 30, 40, hang on, I've lost count, uh, 60 meters of wire here. 60 meters of wire here, 0 0.4, 0 0.6, 0 0.8 millimeter gauges, all of them absolutely fantastic. 60 meters in total. That is an awful lot of wire. Well, it's actually more than 60 meters, it's actually 70 meters, because of course you're going to be getting two lots of the 0 0.8 millimeter gauge in the ice blue and navy colored twisted wire. So think on that. What kind of prices have you seen out there for um, effectively 70 meters of wire. What kind of deals have you seen for 60, 70 meters of wire? On a spool. What you're gonna be getting here, you're getting 0.4 millimeter gauge wires, you're gonna be getting 0.6 millimeter gauge wires, and you're gonna be getting 0.8 millimeter gauge wires. Here's your 0.4, your 0.6, and two lots of your 0.8 as well. What kind of prices have you seen, or what kind of a deal do you reckon you could get for all of this wire together? There's a reason why we've got tons of people coming through on our website at the minute. As soon as we put our graphics on screen, the, these are the graphics here, on our website, if you're watching us on jewelrymaker.com, you can see the price point that this is gonna go down to. Okay, you can see that price point, which is great. It's great for you if you're buying on the web because it means you're kind of ahead of the game. You get that extra little bit of time. And I know that does annoy a lot of people on the telephone lines, but if I tell you I've got tons and tons and tons of people coming through on the website right now for this price, on the phone lines you should be thinking, ah, so it's obviously going to be a great price. Julie in Lancashire, she's got faith in us. She's uh, coming through on the phones. So is Janice, so is Sandra, so is uh, Tracy as well. Loads of you adding this to your baskets already. Absolutely fantastic deal about to come your way. Here's your price. £14.95p for everything, for absolutely everything. Incredible, £14.95p for 60 metres of wire. Well, actually what you're gonna be getting is effectively 70 metres of wire, of course, because you've got two lots of that 0.8 millimetre gauge wire. Now, Janet, what kind of ideas do you have using the wire and the cabochons together? Okay, firstly, I think the wire, the wire as you said, goes together perfectly. Doesn't it, it just? It's just amazing, and for that price, it's, it's a steal. Uh, the flowers, I think necklace, I'm going to turn that into a necklace and the little one's going to make earrings with, so make a complete set from the flowers. Nice! Uh, make um, from the mukai, and as you said, yours was completely different to the image, this one is completely different again. Oh, I like that, is that beautiful. one. It's just got that little touch of colour on the end. Yeah, it's cute. Um, so I'm going to do um, a feature pendant with that, mm -hmm. so it's just got that little colour oh, there. Oh, it it's like it's been dipped in chocolate. So I'm going to make a feature pendant with that. I think I'm going to do a ring with the rose quartz. Nice. Um, and amethyst. You're not quite sure? Yet. Not, not yet, no, but um, we're going to have a go with all of them. 
Do you find some of the wine more useful than others, <laughs> i.e. the 0.4, the 0.6, or the twisted 0.8? Uh, are some of the wines more useful than others, or do they all have their own Well, I think they've all, they've all got their own use. They've all got their own place. Yeah. Uh, for me, if someone said you can only have one gauge, it would be 0.6. Perfect, OK. Because then you could twist that, um, and you could sort of, um, you can weave with it as well. But the 0.4, oh, okay. if you've got a 0.6 and a 0.4, um, you can also weave onto a 0.6. If, if you're sort of really careful. Oh, lovely, okay. <coughs> um, so they've all got the, the place, really, and, you know, you'd be, I'd be lost without all of them, really, to be honest. Fantastic challenge, isn't it? Oh, it's, it's amazing. You are going to have so much fun. <coughs> As you can see, the quantity is going down. I do have people still coming through on the web, on the phone lines for this. If you do want to multi-buy this bundle today, please do just speak to the call centre, speak to Live Help. You can absolutely add more than one of these to your order today. Well done. Jean, Margaret, Ellen... Sorry, not Ellen, Ellen, Elaine, Jill, Anonymous and Suffolk, Brenda, Samantha, Samantha? What am I talking about, Samantha? Elizabeth, June, Joyce, Jill, Lynette, Michelle, Samantha, Elaine, Christina, Morinda, Sharon, Lynn, Della, Joan, Cara, <laughs> Samantha! <gasps> Do come here, Samantha! <laughs> you can always tell how posh someone is by whether they say pardon or what? 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 You can, honestly, you can. My dad taught me that. So, Carol, you can tell how posh someone is by if they say pardon or what? Also by the toilet roll. By the toilet roll? Oh, breaking news here. Apparently by the <laughs> toilet roll you can tell how posh someone is. Go on. If it comes from underneath. If it... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you got into that state in the first place, Chloe. So what, if, if what? What about the loo roll? Right, if the loo roll comes over the top. I know what you mean, yeah. yeah. Oh. Really? Oh, I'm not posh. So the then. loo roll, okay, so you've got a wall. Oh, do you know what? And I've, I've even got a, an improvised loo roll here. Your loo roll is on the wall, yeah? If you've got a loo roll holder, yeah? If the toilet roll hangs that way, you're not posh. So clearly I'm not posh. If it hangs that way, apparently you are. Why is that? Did you just make that up? Probably. Chloe Jones Miller? <laughs> Find her on Facebook? Did you really? No, someone told me that. Someone told you that? Yeah. I have my loo roll that way. Yeah, I go from that way as well. Do you? <laughs> you know what I mean, yeah? <clears throat> I go over the top a lot. I wouldn't, I don't think those are words to live by, to be fair. I don't think you can really judge someone um, on that. Yeah. But whether they say pardon or what, I think, it, what? And I do mean what, not what, but <laughs> what? I. <laughs> I, you <I>. are <laughs> fantastic well done 43 chances remaining in the building now you're all doing brilliantly well done absolutely gorgeous stunning I'm going to have another sip of my tea from my wee Scotty dog oh lovely cup of tea lovely cup of tea well done lots of you still coming through for that now we've had some more texting which is great um, what, to do, what did you want me to show you ah oh, brilliant okay now here at the Genuine Gemstone Company, we are about genuine gemstones. We specialise in genuine gemstones. We are genuine gemstones. We do have the chance today to bring you a very, very special chain. Silver plated brass chain. Look at the size of these garnets. Here is a bit of information about the Genuine Gemstone Company and all of the amazingness that goes on here. Did you know you can purchase incredible jewellery featuring genuine gemstones on our sister channel, Gems? Come along and see what treasures you can find. I'll say Chloe. Sorry, everyone's saying, oh, that was really funny how you said Samantha. I, say, I don't normally say Samantha. I normally say Samantha. Um, I think I was reading another name or somebody said something in my ear. Palm. Pam. It's Pam, isn't it? Pam. Pam. <laughs> Are we going to do this gorgeous chain? Chain, chain, chain. Chain of fools. Great song. 
Oh, do you want to see the picture that I put on Facebook today? On my presenter page, the cutest dog in the whole world. Apart from my dog, obviously. I, I, I don't know if you will able to see that. On my presenter page, Carol Roach. Ah! Aww. Just a random dog with its head out the window. I've got another one as well. This one's hilarious. This one is actually hilarious. Please do join my Facebook page, just for the dog pictures, if nothing else. This is brilliant, check this out. What kind of a noise? What kind of a noise do you reckon this dog's making? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> That's the coolest dog in the world, apart from my dog. Uh, but there we go. Right, okay, gemstone chain now. Carol Roach. C-R-O-L-R-O-A-C-H-E. Here we go. Now, I bought you this the other day in Amethyst. Um, very, very, very excited about what we can do with this. I don't know if you remember the um, gemstone chain that we used to bought you. It looks a little bit like this Labradorite one, actually, that we've got coming up later on in the show. When we first brought this kind of quality of chain to you, it was round about, I reckon, round about oh, eight, nine inches in length. You know, really, really fantastic length. And when we used to bring it to you, first off, all those years ago, I think a gemstone chain of this kind of length, correct me if I'm wrong, was around about 20 pounds. Then it disappeared for the longest time on Jewelry Maker. Then we started to bring you longer and longer and longer lengths of this kind of chain. Now this obviously is handmade 95 sterling silver chain. This is slightly different. However, however, the deal we're gonna offer you today for this chain is astonishing. So kind of 20 pounds, I'd expect to pay that kind of a price because it's 95 sterling silver, it's handmade, and, and, it was, and it was, you know, a good length. This is described as a meter. I'm just putting it out there. I've got quite long arms. This chain that I'm holding here is more than a meter. This is more like a meter and a half. I'm not saying that what you're going to be getting is a meter and a half. All I'm saying is we guarantee you're going to be getting a meter. This is way more than a meter. We like to under-promise and over-deliver, by the way. So, so the chance of you getting more than a meter, you know, fantastic. Right, so this is, this is silver-plated um, brass chain. The garnets you're going to be getting on here are gigantic. They are six millimeters in diameter. They're absolutely huge, huge, huge. I wouldn't describe these as seed beads. I certainly wouldn't describe these as the same kind of beads that we would set into our handmade 95 cents of a chain because they are much, much, much larger, okay? So you're going to be getting a chain here. The one that I've got here is well over a meter. The web, to kind of just warn you, has got absolutely nuts for this deal already this morning. Um, and I've got a few of you on the telephone lines. Beryl from North Yorkshire has already come through and secured two of these. So is Veronica in Greater London. Um, Anonymous in Greater London is coming to get three. Please do multi-buy this today because this almost, this, this will be a sellout. So for gemstones that are larger, granted it's not silver, um, handmade 925 sterling silver chain, <laughs> silver plated brass chain at the end of the day, but you're going to be getting easily a meter here and the gemstones are much, much, much larger. How much would you expect to pay? 20 pounds? Okay, under 20 pounds maybe. 17.95? 14.95? Have a look at your deal today. You're going to love this. 9.95. Amazing. £9.95p. You've gone nuts for these. I'm so pleased for you today. Well done. Absolutely incredible. With gorgeous, genuine, natural garnet. Absolutely amazing. I've actually had a couple of you come back through on the phone lines there, which is great to see. Elizabeth in Greater London is coming to get two. Uh, Delina from West Midlands is coming to get two as well. That's great to see. Please do multi-buy something like this because they always, always, always do sell out. You know, we do come back to kind of recapping products later on in the show if something doesn't sell out. Um, this is one of those deals that you look at and you think, yeah, well, that's just going to go, isn't it? The chance of us actually recapping this deal today. You know, if we have any left at all, we might give you a bit of recap. But um, honestly, this, this deal, superb. Nicholas from Greater London, you've just secured two of these. Well done. Do check your baskets out. I've got about 15 of you at the minute with this in your baskets and you haven't checked it out. Please do check your basket out because if stock gets down to a certain level, okay, and you come through and, and somebody comes through on the phone lines for this and stock isn't able to be allocated to them without taking it out of your basket. It will be taken out of your basket if you haven't checked it out. Tony from Essex, you've just got two of these. Christine from Suffolk, you've just come in to get two of these. Well done to you as well. Absolutely wonderful, well done. 9.95 for all of these. Now, I spoke to Maggie the other day, um, Janet, about yeah. making your own chain. Yeah. And we were talking about using much finer wire, <coughs> much smaller gemstones, but we were talking about it. I think some, it was either a guest designer or a presenter worked out that it would take about a minute per link. Right. Let's say, 
45 seconds per link because the gemstones are larger and the wire is going to be that little bit bigger. There's a meter of chain here. There's a lot of work. That's a lot hours of, of work. Hours and hours and hours and mm. hours and hours of work. Let's, okay, let's even say 30 seconds. 30 seconds a link. That is one minute, two minutes, three minutes, four minutes, five. What am I on about? What am I on about? Yeah, so uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. There's a quarter of an hour there. It'd take me longer than that to do then. <coughs> I'm, 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 you know, I'm saying it, if, you, if you were really up to speed yeah. and it was taking you 30 seconds a link, which I have to say, I don't think it would do. I think it would probably no. take a lot longer than that. Yeah. But I'm just, I'm just being, you know, I'm, I'm being really, really generous. That there, that's about 15 minutes worth of work. Then you've got another 15 minutes. Then you've got pretty much another 15 minutes of work as well. It all adds up, so that's 45 minutes it could potentially take you to make something like this, or you can just click the button now and get it for 9.95. And, and we've done all that hard work for you. We've done all of that hard work for you. Brenda from Yorkshire's coming to get two. Rachel from Norfolk, uh, sorry, uh, yes, from Norfolk's coming to get two. Kathleen from the West Midlands has got two. Anonymous in Derbyshire has got two. And that's not even taking into consideration everyone who's just coming to get one of these. You're going crazy for these. They're absolutely wonderful. It's going to save your time. And they're so useful, gemstone chains, aren't they, they are. Janet? <clears throat> and the thing is, if you do that yourself, you've, you've got to think about the wastage as well. Because there's it's going to exactly, be a lot of wastage. Yeah. yeah. Um, and the time. But it's always done for you at, at that price. And those are not wrap... If I can see properly, they're not wrap loops. They're, they're closed loops. So yes. you can actually open them without wasting any. Good call. Um, so you could just take two off there and you've got a pair of earrings. Do you know what, Dan? That's a really good call, actually, because the smaller chain that we do, the 95 <coughs> sterling silver fine chain, uh, which is fantastic, those are wrapped links that you've got there. Yeah. So the chance of you being able to open those links is actually very slim. Because these are closed links, and the reason why they're closed links as opposed to wrapped links is because the wire is that much thicker and that much stronger. It doesn't yeah. need to be a wrapped link. There is literally no mm. wastage for you. How much wastage would there be if you were using a thick gauge wire to make this chain? There'd be loads of little offcuts. You would waste a lot of wire. Absolutely amazing. Well done. Still got loads of you coming through for this. Susan from South Yorkshire's got two. Oh no, sorry, Patricia has got two. Callers in Leicestershire have got two. Callers in Devon's got two. Brenda from Yorkshire, two. Rachel in Norfolk, two. Still got loads and loads and loads of you coming through for this. Well done. That quantity is going quickly, isn't it? Yeah. And I think it's because we've got so many multi buyers today. Loads and loads and loads of multi bidders. You're still going to get a 30 day money back guarantee if you come through to get two of these. <laughs> So what happens if you send one back? Do you still have that 32 money back guarantee? Or do you or do you, or do you give up any kind of right to talk? No, 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 you've still got a 30 day money back guarantee. Well done, Olivia, absolutely fantastic. We start off with 200, we've now got... Less than 100 left. Well done, everyone, fantastic. Thanks, Kenneth and Jane for coming in for that one. <laughs> you took us under 100, well done. So people still coming in for this um, incredible deal, under £10 for well, well, at least a metre of silver plated brass um, garnet chain. Absolutely superb, stunning. Coming up in the 11 o'clock hour today, we have a clearance section. This is gonna be exciting. Scott actually came downstairs today and said, do you know what Carol, end of the month and it's payday, we're gonna do a clearance section in the 11 o'clock hour. I don't know what, there is coming up, but we've apparently got a clearance section coming up in the 11 o'clock hour. Tell you what, Scott, the savior of jewelry maker. Yeah, he is, it's amazing. In fact, depending on how good the deals are today in the clearance section, I, I want him to come downstairs and take a bow. <laughs> He's amazing, isn't he? We love Scott. Bless him. God love him. Okay, we're starting with this kit. Ooh. Do you know sometimes when you see a strand of gemstones, like our new in strands are absolutely beautiful today, like this strand here, this strand here, which is coming up today, which is concave faceted <gasps> green amethyst. You look at that strand and you think, yeah, do you know what? That is a strand that should be sold on its own. That deserves like, like a whole 15 minutes of us just looking at nothing but this strand, yeah? There's a strand of gemstones as part of this new kit that honestly, 
I, I, I think of is in exactly the same way. This strand of labradorite deserves 20 minutes of us just looking at this and nothing else. This strand of labradorite is one of the most delicious strands I believe we've ever bought you one of the best quality. It's got some of the most incredible labradorescence. This strand, believe it or not, is in this kit today. It's amazing. The prices of our kits today is, it is out of this world. Janet has actually said um, these are the best kits that she's worked with. They are stunning, stunning kits. Um, we're going to see a fantastic demo with this kit. There's a ring that she has made out of one of the labradorites, which, um, by the way, I'm having that one, Dion. No, 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 no. <laughs> Before the show, I said, I'm having that. Dion's not having that one. Dion and I come very close to fisticuffs. Every... <laughs> Ollie, you don't count. I know you've got a wife. I know you've got a wife. I don't care. Dion and I, honestly, we're squabbling over the jewellery before we've even before we've even been over to Janet. Everyone just calm down. <laughs> calm down. Calm down. Yeah, they are amazing today. Gorgeous, aren't they? I know, they're beautiful pieces. Yeah, we're all saying, but they are incredible today, aren't they? They are. Right, here we go. First strand. Beautiful jet black agate plain four millimeter rounds. Gorgeous strand of seed beads here. Really, really beautiful. You, there, there is not a thing on earth you can't do with seed beads. Um, actually, no, I'll rephrase that. I don't think you can actually fix a sink with four millimeter seed beads. Um, but as far as jewelry making related, if you want to make a pendant, if you want to make a pair of earrings, if you want to make a stretchy ring, a stretchy bracelet, an anklet, a rosary chain style uh, piece, any, any single piece of jewelry, there is a place for seed beads. These are black agate four mil rounds. Absolutely gorgeous, perfect size, gorgeous quality. Next strand, clear quartz faceted four mil rounds. How difficult do you reckon it is to facet a gemstone by hand? How difficult do you think it is to facet a gemstone that is four millimeters in size? even more difficult everything has to be downsized everything has to be kind of microscopic these are four millimeter faceted rounds absolutely beautiful gorgeous gorgeous quality now you've got two strands here gorgeous quality now You've got another strand here, of course, the labradorite. This is center stage, absolutely 100% center stage. This is a classic case where the labradorite, yeah, it is center stage. The black agate and the clear quartz really do, really do back up that labradorite with such beauty, with such understated quality, don't they? They really, really do. This has got such a sense of class, this kit. Now with all of our kits here on Jewelry Maker, we love to offer you uh, threading packs. So you're gonna be getting your standard threading pack as part of this kit, monofilament beading thread and elastic. Great for using with seed beads, fantastic uh, for all pieces of jewelry. You're also gonna be getting 115 yellow gold plated copper findings. Here they are, really, really lovely findings. Pack this one, woo! Here we go. So you've got your stunning oval link chain the quality of that isn't it beautiful i'll hold it next to the gems and so you get to see it next to the gems in situ as it were beautiful almost rectangular links here you're also going to be getting beautiful start up head pins which i've got here look at that luster from them can you see that you're also going to be getting these really awesome elongated earring findings Ooh. Yummy. loads and loads and loads of gorgeous quality here but do you know what There's something even more exciting than these findings and the threading pack. <laughs> it's this. This is one of the first kits I can recall bringing you that brings you 10 meters of 0.25 millimeter gauge gold colored copper wire, 10 meters of 0.6 millimeter gauge gold colored copper wire, and 10 meters of 0.8 millimeter gauge wire. There are 30 meters of wire in this kit. I bought your kits before with wire in. There's 30, actually 40 meters of wire here because of course you've got the two lots of the 0.8 millimeter gauge wire twisted together. The, the equivalent of 40 meters of wire in a kit. Now, 
granted i think we're all in agreement the strand of labradorite is the kind of strand that you would sell on its own every single day of the week you know on a sunday afternoon when it's our busiest time of the week or on a saturday morning when it's our busiest time of the week absolutely 100 percent you've then got these two beautiful support strands the agate and the clear quartz and they really do work around that gorgeous labradorite with such beauty with such understated quality you've then got 115 i mean this is like diana ross and the supremes isn't it there's diana ross there there's a Diana, there's Diana Ross there, and there's the two backing singers. I, I, I don't even know their names. I don't even know their names. But you've got Diana Ross in the centre there. Gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful quality. You've then got 115 yellow gold plated copper findings. You've then got 30 metres of wire. Well, actually, they're equivalent to 40 metres of wire because you've got a twisted strand as well. This kit is big, big, big. The quality is big, big, big. And it's classy. It's really, really classy, this kit. The amount of jewellery that Janet's been able to make with this kit because of the wire, because of the findings, and because of the opulent quality of the gemstones is just superb. Um, the price is superb. I've got a number of you at the minute with this in your basket. Check your baskets out. You're going to want to check your baskets out nice and quickly when you see the price point of this. Today, today, this should be over £44 today. How about straight away we give you a discount on that price point? So it should be over 44 pounds today, 24.95, yeah? Brilliant, yeah? That's 20 pounds off that price point. That's about 20 pounds off that price point, yeah? 44 pounds 30 should be the price point that this is today. If you buy everything separately from our website, which you can do tomorrow morning if any of these are available, absolutely, but it's gonna cost you 44 pounds and 30p. So 24 pounds 95p, that should really be the price. But you know what? That's your price today, 21.95. £21.95p, if you look on the internet, for 30 metres of wire, well actually the equivalent of 40 metres of wire, because of the twisted wire that you're going to be getting there, is absolutely sensational. But then the Labradorite on its own, doesn't that strand of Labradorite look like the kind of strand you would pay £19.95 for, maybe even more? Maybe even more! Loads of you coming through for this now. I'm going to bring this strand of Labradorite with me. Loads and loads and loads of you. Oh, sorry, that was our squeaky chair. It was, it was, the, it was the chair! It was! Hey! May not be a lady, but I'm a woman. Um, doesn't this strand of Labradorite, that looks like the kind of strand we'd sell on JM for 19.95 or 21.95, yeah. doesn't it? Well, like, I knew I was going to get Labradorite in the kit. Uh, I didn't know it was going to be that strand. Uh, and I opened it and thought, ooh, yes. It is absolutely out of this <laughs> world. Look at that, look at that. Oh, wow, 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 wow. I think 21.95 just for the Labrador on its own is sensational. Then you're gonna be getting, of course, all this wire. Now the wire undoubtedly has helped you make so much jewelry from this And I just want kit. to point out, this is what I've got left. What? I've got this left after making those pieces of jewelry. What, so all of that's left? All of that, that's You've hardly touched, touched that real. I've hardly touched the um, head pins. Um, I've hardly touched the findings because of the wire. You've got some of the white quartz left as well. Look at all these findings that, and, and wire that um, Janet's got left. So I've got all that left after making that many pieces of jewellery. It's just stunning. So I wanted to bring that just to show you um, what I've got left. That's awesome. Look, there's my ring that Janet's made for me. Hands off, Dion. Hands off. It's absolutely beautiful. I love what you've done with this Labrador. And that's with the 0.6. And that's what I mean about weaving onto a 0.6 with a 0.25. Oh. So that's exactly what that is. So the, you've made this ring using the 0 0.6 wire? Yeah, and used the 0 0.25 to oh, weave onto it. Oh, clever. Clever, clever, clever. I like that. Fantastic. Let's see what else you've done with the Labradorite. Let's have a look at this amazing bangle here. Look at this. That is just beautiful, isn't it? Look at that. I was a bit indulgent there putting two of them in. Oh, I, two, I was right. going to put one, but then I thought, no, the two of them look fab. Isn't that beautiful? You've kind of echoed the shape of the Labrador as well by the way that you've put the wire over the top yeah. of the bangle. It's absolutely gorgeous. So even with gemstones of this kind of size, you can make bangles like this. Now that bangle there, would you sell that for twenty one ninety five? No way, Jose. But it'd be it'd be double, triple that price point. This is what I'm saying with a kit like this, where you've got so much. And I'm going to use this word, but but um, uh, you know, Dion said it's got so so much great value in this kit. It is. You've got so much value in this kit. Whether it's you know inherent value, this is something you could pass down from generation to generation. Where are we with that one? Th uh, this one here just shows you how simple these labradorites are to set into jewellery. 
Wow, quality is just out of this world. And you've got another Labradorite which you've used here. This is a really decadent piece, isn't it? I really enjoyed making that. So yeah. that, that's sort of combining um, the twisted wire, mm -hmm. um, the 0.25, and also the 0.6 in the rosary links as well. Mm. So we've combined all, um, all of the gauges in that. And Sorry, you said the 0 0.6 for the rosary link? Yeah. Look at the links that, um, that Janet's been able to make. So rosary links going up to this really awesome style link. Look at that. How cool is that? Have you twisted the, sorry, have you wrapped it with the 0 0.25? No, that's the 0 0.6. Is it? Yeah. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful wire work. And then of course the findings come into their own with this piece here, where you haven't used any of the wire across the actual, um, chain part of the necklace, I mean, look, look at that. Chain part of the necklace here, using the gorgeous findings, then a bit of the twisted wire there. Love that, love it. Love the shape of this necklace here. This is very on trend. With the chain, it looks beautiful, yeah. isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous, beautiful earrings here as well. There's so much jewelry in this kit. It was just a joy to work with. Mm, it good. was just amazing. And if you bought it, and you, it, it, if you replicated those pieces, you've still got all that left over for your stash. Yeah. You know, you, it, so it is real value for money. 100%. Now, technique, you're going to show us the pendant. This, this pendant here, because yeah. it is, it, it, you can so simply make a feature of these gorgeous Labradorite beads. How did you, how did you do this then, uh, Janet? But to, the thing is as well when you get them you don't have to think oh which one shall i use as the feature one which one is sort of got the best shiller on it because they're all exactly the same they've all got, they've all got on. you know yeah. a really decent amount it's beautiful right so to do to, to make this <laughs> to make the pendant i took a, a length of wire which is what probably i don't know about 25 inches i do mm -hmm. inches i don't do um i'm old you see and then just take the center point and what we're going to do is make a wrapped just make a quick wrap loop and that's going to be your your bail so just wrap around there a couple of times just try and keep it as neat as you can uh -huh. there you go so wrap around a couple of times so you've then got a wrapped loop on there then mm -hmm. slip your pendant onto one of the sections gorgeous there we go you've got that and then bring that along the back and wrap it around You've then got two, so you've then got the pendant with, with the loop and two pieces of the 0 0.6 Gorgeous. coming off from here. Look so that's that labradorescence, oh my it, word. It's absolutely amazing. Look, look at that! Look at it, you just can't. <whistles> look at it, it's gorgeous. Oh, I'm so sorry. I, no, one with little whistle's not that bad. Make you, did that make you no, feel no, no. sick? Oh, I keep forgetting. Whistle a tune and I shall probably pass out, but. <laughs> there, so you've got the two pieces coming Lovely. from there. Then we take the 0.25 and then just quickly wrap it around that top section. You can cut that bit off afterwards. And then we're just going to do a little bit of a, a weave. I didn't do too much of a weave, just an, enough just to give it a bit of interest. So uh -huh. just sort of around, around that one and then through and around that one so really I just sort of went round a couple of times each one you can do as, as many as you want you Lovely. can do whatever whatever weave you want here if I just do that quickly and then as I was going along I just dropped on I think I dropped on three of the beads uh, yes you did but you can weave it and have it so have beads all the way down and no I like what you've done there but what I did I did three so keep them just the bead width apart mm-hmm and then wrap in, it was getting a bit tangled, there we go. Just wrap, wrap that in so you've got a bead on. Gorgeous. On and then just continue down and put as many beads on as you want um, for the design. What I'll do is I'll just quickly just do a, a few. Yeah, go for it. A few on there so we can move on to the next section. But what I, would, uh, what I did, I put three on. Um, but you can you put as many as you want on. Yeah, I, I quite like the fact you've only used three. I don't think it, um, it needs any more than that. No, what I did, I, I did the three on and then I just sort of stretched it out a little mm. bit. So what you can do is then put as many beads on there as, as you want. Mm -hmm. And then I'll cut that little bit off there. I won't go all yeah, the way down with the beads. How do you secure it at the bottom? Oh, I suppose you put it through the... 
So we're yeah. at that section now. So you've got the bead. So bring it across the front of your gemstone. Yeah. So it's going to be sitting there. Yeah. And then what I did, go to the back. Just if you can, just pull that a little bit. Mm hmm. And then go around. Do it one at a time. It's easier. Go through that back oh, section. Oh, okay. Sorry, I'm going to have to put that down just while I do that. And that kind of creates an anchor. Sorry, there you go. That's all right. It goes through there. Get the other one, put that one through as well. Try and keep them sort of, don't try not to cross them over too much. There. And then, if you put it where you want it, pull it into shape. And then bring that round. Lovely. And bend it over. So it sort of catches there. And then do exactly the same with the other one. And bring it around and it'll catch, uh -huh. catch there. So now you should have your wrap section here, uh, a lot neater than mine because you've wrapped it all the way down, but that's the, that's the idea of it. And then if you bring both of the sections then, I think what I did, but again, each one is going to be completely different. Absolutely, so you, you're yeah. going to be sort of making your own, what you can do actually is wrap it around the bottom and then bring it back to the front mm -hmm. and just bring the two pieces there. Can you see that? There. So from the bottom then, I've gone around the back section so it's secure, brought it back to the front and there. And then all you need to do is wrap it around that bail section. Obviously you'll do it a lot neater than I've done it because uh, you'll have a bit of time to spend on it. And then snip that off. Just closing all your little bits. Yeah. And basically, that, that's your pendant. Isn't that gorgeous? Obviously, you'll have gemstones along this section. Uh, but then having the straight wires mirroring um, that shape is just really, really And you can carry on tweaking it afterwards, can't yeah. you? Because it's yeah. wire that you're using, so it's nice and malleable. Look but, at that. How effective is that? But that's the, the basic technique. And then you can sort of embellish it, as you, as you say, with as much wire yeah. or as many gemstones as you want. You're getting about five on the strand, um, if any of you are wondering. So you've got enough to make five of those pendants or, you know, make rings out of them as well. Such a lovely, lovely technique, this one. Uh, Hazel says, hi, Carol, Janet and crew. Stunning, decadent pieces, Janet. Amazed how you make something completely different every time. What's your secret? What is your secret, Ooh, Janet? Um, I don't know, Hazel. I don't know, Carol. It's just the gemstones, I think. I think when you get the gemstones and you sit down with them, they, they speak to you. Yeah. They do. And something like this deserves to be in sort of high-end pieces, that little bit more decorative. Oh, look. Um, and they do. They just sort of command you to do certain things. Well, you've kind of echoed the shape of the labradorite in the wire work there. So I can see how one part of Follows on. one part of a kit yeah. leads you leads you down a certain yeah. avenue it's fascinating isn't it um thank you for that it was a lovely text uh, gail from the west midlands jan you've uh, you've gone and done it again absolutely gorgeous uh love to all the team and that's gail thank in you, gail. uh tipton isn't that lovely thank you Oh, I like it. Sue from London. Good morning, ladies. Absolutely stunning jewelry, Janet. I always love your designs, and these look so elegant and timeless. Tell you what, Janet's not going to be able to get out the door today. Oh, I love it. Uh, Hazel has texted Janet. How can I keep my 0.4 wires straight whilst doing figure eight weaves, please? When I push it down, they make a C shape. Never wire. Uh, I've never wire weaved before. Uh, using three base wires of 0.8 following Laura Binding's uh, wrapped uh, design inspiration wrapped pendant. Wow, there's lots of letters and numbers in that text. That that, that <laughs> confused me. Uh, many thanks, Hazel. Do you understand that? So keeping the 0.4 straight whilst doing a figure of eight. Uh, I suppose it depends what gauge you're actually weaving onto as well. Yeah. If you, you ga you, you're weaving onto sort of a really structural like a, a one mil or something, it's make sure you've got your tension. I would say it's tension. If, if you're not getting a straight line, I would say it's the tension. Um, but how to keep it... Yeah, I, I would just say it's tension, really, to be honest. Um, okay. And as you do it, every time you do a weave, try and sort of straighten the wire through your fingers. Do a weave and then straighten it a little bit so that the wire that you're using is straight to start with. If you've got a kink in it to start with, then you might that might be why you're getting bent. So constantly in it as well. working the wire as well. Yes, yeah. As you as you work in okay. it, constantly work it. Yeah. And keep the tension. 
Thanks for that, Janet. That's really helpful. Thank you. Uh, Kim and Benfordshire. Carol, I love Janet's design so much. I bought this kit today and it's my birthday. Yay. Oh, Kim. Happy birthday, Kim. Happy birthday, Kim. Fantastic. Emily for the West Midlands. Love, uh, love to be in your brain for just five minutes. You're very <laughs> talented. Beautiful. You wouldn't. You wouldn't want to be in there. Honestly. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to go there. <laughs> uh, right, let's go and see some of your incredible designs on today's Wall of Fame. <laughs> lovely, I've got number 378 here. This is a lovely bit of wire work. Paula from Lancashire. Hi, all the jewelry maker. Here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. I started this pendant on the amazing uh, Laura Bindings Advanced Works Wire Works Wire Work course and finished it at home. The stone is a triangular serpentine with 0.4 and 1 mil gauge wire, all from Jewelry Maker. I'm rather pleased with the result and total wire work um, addicts now. Good luck to everyone in this week's draw. And that's from Paula. Um, thank you so much, Paula. That is absolutely beautiful. You clearly picked up so many fantastic um, skills on the wire workshop because I have to say your wire work is so neat. That's Isn't beautiful. that stunning? That's amazing. Clever, clever, clever. Yeah, well done. Thanks for that, Paula. Best of luck. And I've got 375. Wow. And this is from uh, Julie Linney. I uh, don't know where Julie is, but hi, Julie. Um, and Julie says, hi. Um, oh, this is my second entry to the Wall of Fame. I made this for a friend for her birthday. It's made from July's birthstone ruby with pearls. All findings and gemstones from JM. Hoping for a win as I've become a bit obsessed and only been making jewellery for a couple of months. Wow! So it gets you quickly, doesn't it? I love the earring findings with the chain on. Beautiful, aren't they? Yeah. They're my kind of earrings. Yeah, that works Fabulous. really, really well. Uh, number 377 here. This is absolutely gorgeous. This is the kind of piece I wear every single day. Uh, from Lorraine Robinson in Aldershot. Morning, everyone. Hope it's bright and sunny where you are. Is it bright and sunny this morning? It's sunny, kind of. It's not raining, which is great. Um, so far, blue skies here in Aldershot. Um, here is this week's Wall of Fame entry. A silver 0.4 millimetre gauge wire Viking knit bracelet with hematite. Uh, silver rounds and silver hematite stars uh, and that's from Lorraine. Lorraine that's absolutely beautiful such a wearable piece that one you could wear that with anything gorgeous you're number 377 best of luck this is 374 and it's a selection of earrings from Chris Gray and Chris is in Hamilton in Scotland and Chris says this is uh, a few pairs of earrings I made from a bead scoop using memory wire beading thread shepherd's hooks and head pins mm -hmm. I use pearls black onyx and ruby hope you like them That that's just shows you simple designs, how, how effective and how stunning they can be. Mm. Absolutely beautiful, aren't yeah. they? Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. Thank you very much well for done. that. This is number 376. Ooh. Beautiful pendants. I haven't seen this kind of design before. Um, from Wendy in Cool Nottinghamshire. Is cool a place or is it cool in Nottinghamshire? I don't know. Might be cool. I don't know. Morning to my jewellery maker lovelies at JM Towers. Hi. Hope you're doing well. Uh, loving the show uh, with guest designers and the total crazy presenters. I need to lay down after each show because of uh, because my sides ache so much with laughing. That Jenny Cleary is bonkers. And what can I say about Carol? A total nutter. <laughs> Keep your opinions to yourself, Wendy. If you're feeling down, watch the show. Uh, a watch a show jewelry maker. The Jane presenters are the best tonic. Here's my entry of this week's Wall of Fame. Uh, two necklaces using leather cords, silver and gold plated spacer beads, jasper flowers, and silver and gold wire. For the gold necklace, I hand knotted the leather cord to give it a different, uh, to give a different, and the silver necklace using a three strands of leather cord to give it different, a different look maybe? I think you might have missed a word out there, that's okay. Uh, good luck to everyone uh, for the draw on Wednesday. Best wishes, that's Wendy. Thanks, Wendy. I'm glad you enjoy the show. I love your pieces, thank you. Is that it? Is that it? That's it? That was quick. Coming up in just a few seconds. Yes, I'm still wearing this, thank you, Dion. Hands <laughs> off, I'm still wearing this. Still a couple of that gorgeous last kit available at 21.95, by the way. Coming up after the break, genuine Keishi pearls. Oh my word.
Baker are having a web exclusive sale on 95 sterling silver. Head over to our website now and take advantage of up to 75% off. All stock must go, but be quick because if you miss it, you'll miss out. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order for just 50p and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates for items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from the Genuine Gemstone Company. Jewelrymaker ships to the following countries. We offer two delivery services, standard and premium. So wherever you are in the world, Jewelrymaker are never far away. Get involved with Jewelry Maker by sending the studio a message during our live hours. You can send a text to 60777 and start your message with JM Studio or alternatively go to our website and click on watch the live show. Simply type your message into the box and press send. Make sure you stay tuned in case your message is read out. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. Do you have a question that you need answering? Well, did you know you can ask to speak to an accredited jewellery professional in our call centre? Trained by the GIA, you can ask us any gemological question and we'll do our best to help. We don't just sell gemstones, we know gemstones. That's why when you buy from us, you're buying with confidence. Buy your genuine gemstones from genuine accredited jewellery professionals. What a treat. What an absolute treat. The most beautiful, beautiful strands of Keishi pearls. Um, I am a huge fan of the Keishi pearl, um, but I have to say, this strand has kind of stumped me a little bit. Um, Keishi pearls, what are Keishi pearls? Okay, well, Keishi pearls tend to be really really little pearls which are not perfect rounds they're not potato shaped they're not ovals they look melted they can be totally flat or they can have um, uh, different kind of um, melted qualities to them or twisted qualities to them but they tend to be really really little really 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 petite which is why this strand has stumped me because this strand of Keishi pearls is enormous Look at the diameters on that strand, on the, on, on, on the details there. 13 by 11, okay, well that's a very, very large pearl, to 19 by 12 millimeters. I mean, some of these are gigantic. Definitely some of the largest Keishi pearls, or it is, it is the largest strand of Keishi pearls I have ever seen. Keishi pearls are normally really really petite just looking at the designs that we've got on the wall over there i don't think we've got any keishi pearl examples over there but keishi pearls are normally round about five six maybe seven mil these are absolutely gigantic if you're looking for perfect round pearls then go for then go for shell pearl yeah um if you're looking for organic, natural quality, go for this strand. Ah, perfect. Dion, really, really helpfully, has just bought me some pieces of jewelry with Keishi pearls in. Can I just make you aware of something? 
Anonymous in Greater London has just bought 10 strands of this. Okay. In fact, of everyone who's come through to get this so far, there's only two people who haven't multi-bought. Gives you a clear indication of how low this is going to go, yeah? These are the kind of um, uh, I mean, beautiful pieces of jewellery here, which the lovely... Is it did... Oh, Susanna made this. Absolutely gorgeous. This is the kind of size I attribute with Keishi pearls, because these are Keishi pearls. Beautiful Keishi pearl necklace and a beautiful Keishi pearl bangle. And... Yeah, as, as, as Ollie has just said in my ear, blatantly, whoever's just come through to get 10 strands of these is, has, has got a wedding commission. Absolutely, 100%. Casey pearls um, are very, very uh, beautiful in bridal pieces. And this is the kind of size I would attribute with Casey pearls. Can I just hold the strand of Casey pearls that we've got today against the pieces that we've got here? Look at the size difference. I'm not holding one that close to you and the, and the other one's really far away. Look, they are both right next to each other. Look at the size difference. Yeah, they're about two, maybe even three times the size of the pearls you're going to be getting here. Now, of course, for wedding jewellery, for, um, uh, for landmark jewellery, whether it's for someone's birthday or for uh, someone's prom or for someone who's just passed their driving test or their A-levels or their GCSEs or someone who's just graduated. Absolutely fantastic. Um, the fact of the matter is, these Keishi pearls, you're going to get the organic quality. You, every single one is going to be different. They're all going to be round about the kind of sizes you're going to be seeing here. Otherwise, we wouldn't have put the sizes um, on the graphics because that would totally be false representation. You know, do expect to get pearls which are round about 13 by 11 to round about 19 by 12 millimeters in diameter. Start off with 200 strands of this. Look how quickly the quantity is going. There is a reason why that quantity is going so quickly. And it's because Casey pearls like this, I don't think I've ever seen Casey pearls of this size. I don't think I've ever bought you Casey pearls which are anywhere near 13 by 11 millimeter diameter, let alone 19 by 12 millimeters in diameter. I mean, these are giants in the Casey pearl world. They're like giant Casey pearls. The price for this is amazing. The majority of you coming through to get this today are multi-buying. In fact, pretty much all of you are multi-buying on this round today. The price is extraordinary. It's a true jewellery maker price point. £9.95p for Keishi pearls, which are off the Richter scale. And if somebody asked me um, to, I don't know, if, I, if somebody bet me yesterday and said, what kind of price or what kind of size do you think Casey pearls go up to i would have put money on the fact that Casey pearls really the largest Casey pearl you're gonna see is round about nine mil in size if that thinking oh i'll give another couple of mil just for grace um these are roughly 11 by 13 to 19 by 12 millimeters they are huge can i pop this up to my neckline just so you get an idea of just how large these actually are Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. And the great thing about Casey pearls is a lot of the time you get a very, very, very high quality nacre, a very, very high quality orient. It should look like these gemstones glow, glow from within, which is exactly what they're doing there. And the great thing about having such large gemstones is you get a bigger surface area. Because they're not rounds, so you get a much flatter um, surface area. So you get even more of that luminous, uh, luminescent quality. They're beautiful, aren't they? Yeah, they look like kind of silk or satin the way they reflect the light, don't they? It's exactly what they should look like. They, they should look like they're glowing. This is why, and this kind of quality which you're seeing here, displayed on this gorgeous strand of Casey pearls, this is why pearl extract is sometimes used in really expensive moisturizers because it makes your skin look luminescent and like satin. And that's all the rage at the minute, isn't it? During the 80s, it was all about kind of, um, you know, well, definitely on the cheekbones, kind of having that kind of, um, that, that bit of shine. But now, definitely in face creams, you know, you get um, um, illuminating uh, foundations and illuminating uh, face creams as well, day creams uh, that you use. And, and, and some of the qualities which they use in some of the expensive high-end moisturizers come from pearls. And you can see why, can't you? Absolutely gorgeous. Really, really amazing. Just wonderful. 76 opportunities remaining. We start off with 200. Don't take my word for it, though. Don't take my word for it. Look at the quantity and, and, and look how quickly that quantity is going down. You're making that happen because of the price, because of the size, because of the shape, because of the deal. 
They're big Casey Pearls. You must have worked That's with Casey Pearls before, but have you ever seen Casey Pearls of this size? No, definitely not. They're absolutely beautiful and just restrung as they are, just mm. makes such a beautiful, interesting piece of jewellery. Well, they're just. <clears throat> and just two of them on, on an earring, you know, beautiful. They're gorgeous, yeah. aren't they? I think, yeah, I, you know, I think, I think Janet's right, just two of them in a pair of earrings, because they're nice and big. Yeah. You know, they really are extraordinarily big. Two of them in a pair of earrings. That could be a pair of earrings you sell for easily 10, 12 pounds. I mean, if you use precious metal findings, I personally only use them, only ever use precious metal findings to make pearl uh, pieces. Um, and, uh, you know, a pair of earrings that's, you know, 12, 15 pounds maybe even, you know, judging on the size of the pearls. Rings out of these as well. You can make some beautiful yeah. rings out of these because uh, some of these are relatively flat. Beautiful wire wrapped ring. Wouldn't that be gorgeous for your bridesmaids? Maybe if you're going to be wearing pearls as a bride on your wedding day. Pearls are meant to be good luck to wear on your wedding day, aren't they? They're meant to stop the bride from crying. That, that does not work. I wore pearls on my wedding day and I cried like a baby. Cried like a baby. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous, aren't they? Really, really beautiful quality there. Well done. 55 opportunities remaining in the building now. That's gorgeous. Oh, sorry, we've actually got less than 55, 54 chances remaining in the building now. We've got about 40 opportunities remaining in the building. And I'll tell you something, if every single one of you checks out your basket now, because I've got Magdalene, I've got um, uh, Amanda, I've got Carla, Julie, uh, Anne-Marie, Nesta, Deborah, Denise, Anonymous in Leicestershire, Kira, Michelle, Anonymous in Suffolk. If you all check your baskets out <coughs> now, um, then we'll have much, much, much a few with... Uh, uh, much 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 fewer than uh, 40 chances remaining or 30 now well done loads of you buying more than one of these today carolyn from wilshire's just coming to get three and in essex two two threes fours we had a caller in london who came through to get 10 of these i don't blame you at all it doesn't surprise me at all with quality like this and size like this yeah and a price point of course to suit amazing well done wicked right next got some amazing deals on today's show Green amethyst and purple amethyst. We've got some amazing purple amethyst concave faceted gems coming up later on in the show. Whichever way you look at them, they are just out of this world. Woo! That's going to be coming up later on in the show. Uh, but now we've got an amazing bundle, double trouble amethyst bundle, where you're going to be getting purple amethyst, which I'm sure pretty much everyone's heard of. Even if you don't really know a huge amount about gemstones, I'm sure you've heard of purple amethyst, yeah? Beautiful purple amethyst rounds. Gorgeous color, beautiful tone. Really great saturation of color as well. Which with an amethyst, which with quartz in, in, in general, you wouldn't expect to get. And then a green amethyst. Such a soft, gentle, silvery green tone. Love, love, love. Great clarity on this. Again, something else you wouldn't normally expect to get with them, um, with amethyst or with quartz in general, you don't expect to get loads and loads of clarity. You wouldn't expect to get loads of clarity in a strand of rose quartz, would you? No, exactly, or, or even citrine. You're getting loads and loads and loads of gorgeous clarity here. Bright white brilliance. Don't you love that soft, gentle green color? It's not overpowering, it's very, very delicate. It's, a, it's, it, it's, it's the slightest hint of silvery green you're gonna be getting here. Double trouble deal here. It's gonna be a fantastic deal. Give us a call on our free phone number or get involved on our website, jewelrymaker.com. You've got one of the most famous gemstones in the world, a gem which pretty much every single person has heard of. It's one of our biggest selling gemstones on Jewelry Maker as well. Great, and, and, and Purple Amethyst is one of our absolute all time biggest sellers on this channel. And of course with purple, there is a shade of purple which will suit absolutely everyone. In fact, purple suits absolutely everyone. Really, almost whatever shade. Here's your deal today. 6.95. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I pulled a funny face then. So. Yep. Six pounds ninety-five p. No, that's not Do you remember when we fair. first launched qualities like this with the tassels on? Do you remember those? Yeah, yeah. Do you remember the kind of prices they launched at? Fourteen ninety-five, sixteen ninety-five, nineteen ninety-five, six ninety-five for both strands. I'm upset now. Are you upset? I want them. I love amethyst. It's my number one. Is it really? Why is that? I don't know. I think I love purple amethyst. Yeah. But I love the green amethyst as so well. Why? It's just I don't know what it is about amethyst. It, whenever I see anything in amethyst, it just draws me to it. Just draws me. I just I think it's absolutely beautiful. Green amethyst um, speaks to me as well. It's amazing. You know how um, Gemma Crow said on the show before how Ruby speaks to her. Whenever she works with Ruby, she feels a certain way. It just it, yeah. it, she absolutely loves it. And you feel the same way about um, working with Amethyst? 
just, some gems, just they do, it. they do speak to you, don't yeah. they? I mean, I don't know a lot about sort of um, myth, and legends. myth and legends and, and things mm. about gemstones, but amethyst just draws me, whatever it is, it's just beautiful. And I don't think it's the colour because the, the green amethyst does it as well. Yeah. So it's just stunning. And Absolutely at that beautiful, price, isn't it? that's yeah. ridiculous. You see, and, and whilst I've been nattering away to uh, Janet there, without looking at the call screen, I'm now looking back at the call screen, which is full of names now. Because I don't think you were expecting 6.95 at all, were you? No, no, no. It's amazing though, isn't it? Yeah. Get it, add it to your order. Lots of multi buys on this incredible deal as well. You know, whether you're into Myth and Legend of Gemstones or not, you know, this is the birthstone of uh, February. Um, a gemstone which is normally attributed with um, kings, not necessarily queens actually, but, 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 but definitely um, uh, members of aristocracy. Uh, the cardinal gemstone, lots of bishops and priests used to wear this incredible gemstone as well. Um, OMG, Dion! Getting loads of texts in today in support of Dion. And Janet as well. People saying how generally mental the show is today. I know. <laughs> oh, wait, hang on, we get the glasses on. Here we go. This is from Melissa. Hi, Carol. Can you please give a shout out to my Nana, who will be watching the show every morning. Uh, love you, Nana. Melissa. Thanks, Carol. Ah, Nana. Melissa loves you. We love you too. We love you too, Nana. My mum is, uh, is Nana. Yeah. No, no, no. I don't call my mum Nana because she's my mum. Uh, <laughs> no. Um, but my, but my, uh, but to my, to my, daughter she is nana john's mum is uh grandma bear grandma bear grandma bear and then my father-in-law is great bear um <laughs> and uh and uh my dad is skip i know it sounds a bit weird but my dad loves sailing uh, and he is and he is the he is the uh, skipper of the boat so we call him skip nana and skip nana and skip and grandma bear and great bear <laughs> weird isn't it it's funny what people call each other do you have any weird nicknames, uh, Janet? Um, any you can say on the show? My other half's got a horrible name for me. Oh no! Calls me Big Bird. Because <gasps> you're tall. I'm hoping that's what it is. <laughs> oh yeah, it won't be any other reason. Goodness me! Do you know Ruth Lynette, presenter Ruth Lynette? Yeah. And um, who presents on Jury Maker? We all call her Big Bird. <laughs> She's in my phone actually. Has Big Bird, B Bird. Mind you, she is six. How 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 tall is Ruth? She's six foot one, isn't she? I don't know. I've never met. I've not met Ruth. Have you not met Ruth? Oh no. my word! She's absolutely gorgeous. She's absolutely gorgeous. I think she's about six foot one, isn't she? I'm five twelve. You're five twelve. I love being tall. I'm, f I'm about five ten. About five ten. I love being tall. 5 I think five twelve sounds much better than six foot. But I always say five twelve. Five twelve. Yeah, is that that is six foot. It, it does sound better, doesn't it? It does. Five twelve. Yeah. Kerry, how tall are you? Five four. Can't be in the uh, in the tall club. You can be in the amazing club. Box number who? Number one. Oh ah! Now Dion put this bundle together today. She's been very excited about it. This is really really awesome. This bundle. I didn't know we had these back in stock. Apparently we do. Um, let me just let me just get the old fingerprints off it. Here we go. So, what do you reckon? Oh, hang on. Come on, play ball. What do you reckon that is? What do you reckon it is? Oh. Tin Man's Heart? <laughs> is, it a, is it a badge? No. Do you want to see an amazing transformation? Is it something to do with Iron Man? It's Iron Man's heart. Oh, this is Robert Downey Jr.'s heart. Oh, wow. <laughs> you un... Look at this. Look at this. You un unravel the bits around the heart. You've made your own handbag hook. It is incredible. Now, how does this work again? This goes on, this goes on top of the table. Yeah? That hangs down underneath the table. You hang your handbag on there. How amazing! Keep it nice and safe. I like that. Really, really like that. Heart-shaped, silver-plated handbag hook. Eight by 33 millimeters in diameter. Now, you've got a great uh, bezel here, just right for setting some gemstones in. So, what are we gonna give you as part of this deal? Are these all three mils? Oh, they're beautiful. 
blue agate faceted three mil rounds. Faceted three mil rounds? How on earth do you facet a three mil round gemstone? Goodness me. Red agate three mil rounds and multicolour agate faceted three mil rounds. You're also going to be getting, to use all of these with your bezel here, I'll hold that just like that, you're also going to be getting your tube of E6000 jewellery making glue as well. So you can set your gemstones into your bezel. Okay, so you've got your glue, you've got your handbag charm, sorry, not your handbag charm, your handbag holder, hook, and you've also got your three strands of genuine gemstones. OMG, I've been wanting this for so long, says Emily from the West Midlands. Fantastic. It's going to be a great deal as well, Emily. It's going to be an absolutely fantastic price point. Three strands of genuine gemstones, your handbag hook, and your E6000 glue. Here's your price point. You're going to love it. Woo! £14.95p. Did I mention as well, on the back of the handbag hook, that's a magnet there. That's a magnet. Yeah. Stick it on your fridge when you're not using it. Looks like a strong magnet as well. How can we test it out? I've got anything metal I can stick it to. I don't know if we do. £14.95p for everything you can see here. So for your handbag hook, your three strands of genuine gemstones and your E6000 glue. Isn't that brilliant? What a great bundle. What a different bundle. I can have thought of that. Have you used these handbag hooks yet, um, uh, Janet? I haven't, no. Have you seen them before? I haven't, no. <gasps> First time I've seen them. I love them. Have you seen handbag hooks uh, before? I've seen people use them yes. before. Yeah. They're really nifty. Yeah. But that's really handy, isn't it? You yeah. Know, that's amazing. And then you can embellish it with, with gemstones as well, even better. Yeah. Absolutely. Ollie's saying he imagines, he, he imagines this for the lady who's very organised. Absolutely. Yeah. I reckon, yeah, yeah, all of our friends are going to be dead jealous of this one. Yeah, it's one of those, isn't it? You know, your mate is really organised. I hate putting my handbag on the floor. My husband bought me a beautiful handbag um, uh, um, a few months ago, absolutely gorgeous, and I refuse to put it on the floor. I hate putting it on the floor wherever I go. So honestly, um, it, it would be to the point where I would get to a restaurant and have to ask for another chair for the table so I could put my handbag on a chair. You know, and I don't like doing that. I mean, it's not like, I mean, it's like, you know, I'm thinking the handbag's a child or something like that, which it isn't, obviously, it's just a handbag. But I don't want to put it on the floor. This solves that problem. It does, doesn't it? Embellish it with the gemstones. I don't actually ask for another chair. I just go and nick a chair off another table. A chair that no one's sitting in, obviously, because that would be a bit weird. Come and sit with us. <laughs> Hold my back. <laughs> <laughs> no, that would be ever so strange. And you've got your E6000 glue as well. Fantastic for jewellery making. Woo, 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 woo! Where are we going now, love? I didn't know we had this in the show today. I want one of those as well. Do you? Yeah. It's a bead mat, but it's sticky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that doesn't sound very attractive, does it? Um, it is meant to be sticky, I hate to add. You know what I... Oh, sorry. Love, 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 love this bead mat. The bead mat XL. There's the packaging that it's going to come in. Still only paying 295 pin per order, by the way. No matter how much you order. No matter how much you order. Your beadsmith sticky bead mat. Why is this such a fantastic thing? Why do why whenever we have it on the show? Why do hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of you come through to get this? There are lots of different reasons, actually. Uh, you can make your piece of genuine gemstone jewellery on. It's exactly the same as the pink uh, bead mat that we have here, but with a few added extra bonuses. This, for instance, is a floppy bead mat. Okay, so easy for you to take away with you. You can roll it up, put it in your bag. Okay, so you can uh, roll it up and put it in your bag. So rather than taking a rigid board, uh, you, can, uh, you can roll it up and put it in your bag. You can place all your jewellery on it. You can see that there are lots of little, um, that, that you've got the kind of the template to make your necklaces and bracelets. It's got little measurements there and centimetres and inches as well, which is fantastic. Um, you've also got on the back, which is exactly the same, loads and loads and loads of little dots so you can measure your pieces of jewellery out, put your, uh, put your genuine gemstones out as well. Now, are you one of those jewellery makers are you one of those jewellery makers who sometimes gets neck ache and back ache at the top of your back because you're making pieces of jewellery over the top of your table? 
no more because you can literally get your sticky bead mat put something under your sticky bead mat like a uh, I don't know a box or a book yeah and you can make pieces of jewelry that are raised up a little bit so you can make them raised up and because it's sticky gemstones and findings are going to stick to them so I'm not saying that if you tip it upside down, the gemstones and the findings are going to stick to the ball because that is a little bit unrealistic. However, if you're making pieces of genuine gemstone jewelry on an angle, you will find that gemstones and findings will really, really nicely and easily um, stick to the board. So you can work on that angle. So you don't need to make jewelry flat on a table anymore. You can make it on that ever so slight angle. Now, I had a text in from Hillary who says, I have a sticky bead mat and I don't know how I manage with that one. Buy one, guys, or two. I like that. I like that. Why not buy two? Because a lot of our guest designers, a lot of you I know are working on more than one project at a time. Uh, Jill in Staffordshire, these are brilliant. Uh, saves chasing beads all around the table and floor every day. Yeah, yeah, it does, doesn't it? It's fantastic. Emily from the West Midlands, saves going mental, losing beads as it makes you slightly insane. <laughs> well, Emily, there you go. Um, it will lose its stickiness after a while, but don't worry, because to refresh the stickiness, you just um, make it a little bit damp. Um, and, then, and then do you dry it off or do you not dry it off? I can't remember. Uh, no, you let it dry. When it starts to gather dust or debris, simply rinse it with water and let it dry. It will refresh and become as sticky as when it was new. It's absolutely fantastic, this board. Really, really wonderful. And it has been kind of life-changing for a lot of you out there who, who don't want to um, work on a board like that, who would much rather work on a board at a slight angle because it's a little bit easier, a little bit easier on your, um, on your neck and the top of your back. So, right, great, price point. This has historically been one of our fastest selling products on Jewelry Maker. Whenever we've had it, whether it's been in stock or whether it's been bought to air um, twice in a week. The deal that we offer you for this bead mat is wonderful. And you can see by the comments in the text, you know, people have taken the time to text us this morning and say how fantastic this bead mat is. So you, you, know, you, you clearly do love this incredible, in, incredible bead mat. The price for this though, is I think its biggest, its biggest, um, its biggest uh, selling point, £12.95p. Uh, £12.95 for a board that's gonna save you time. Uh, running around after gemstones. It's gonna save you energy running after gemstones. It's probably gonna save your back and your neck a little bit as well, because you'll be able to work on that slight angle. It's very, very portable as well. So people um, quite often have two or three of these, roll them up and take them away with them. You can take it on a plane if you're gonna be making pieces of jewelry on a plane, and you don't have to worry about taking a big rigid board with you, because you can literally just fold it up to nothing. It is the most fantastic, fantastic, fantastic board. Uh, now. Janet, for all those reasons, is that the reason, are those the reasons why you want the sticky bead mat? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> basically. Um, because like, like you say, when you're working, um, I've got a work room um, and I've got lots and lots of bead boards that I use. But when you're actually working on, um, I work on a macrame board, mm -hmm. um, but there's lots of times you, you sort of cut up a strand and they, everything goes everywhere. If you're doing that on this board, um, they're not gonna do that. And also you can lay out your designs as well. Mm. Um, and on the pink board, it's great because you can lay out a design. But if you've got sort of a design that's um, not the sort of normal necklace shape, yeah, you can still do that on, on here. Yeah, exactly. So if you're making a bib shape, mm -hmm. you can still lay out that design on here. Absolutely. And things will stay in place. And you can even leave that to one side mm -hmm. and then work from something else and just sort of take off what you need at a time to build up your piece. Yeah, it is wonderful. It has it has changed the lives and changed the way that people make jewelry so much since we've had it in stock. It's absolutely wonderful. Loads of you coming through for this. And as soon as it starts to get dusty or picks a bit of um, debris, give it a wash, let it dry. And that stickiness is just rejuvenated. Just like magic, amazing. Well done, every single one of you coming through to get that. There's still some of these left. Lots of you multi-buying, great, awesome. Next, I'm gonna pop that down there. Next kit, everyone. Next new kit is the next new kit. Next new kit is the next new kit. Just me then. Just me singing today. Great. <laughs> left-handed mug. Very strange to drink out of a left-handed mug. Left-handed mug. Yeah, because you need to drink with this facing forward, with the collar of the dog facing forward, don't you? Which means it's left-handed. Someone's posted on my Facebook page, actually. Um, Isabella has put on my Facebook page, just loving the show, darling. Lou rolls when it hangs over must be folded to a point for posh. 
Yeah, they do that in uh, hotel in hotels, don't they? And Anne has put one on this, um, a picture of a Westie dog. Unfortunately, I can't show it because I don't want to show other people's names and stuff like that on Facebook. I think they're kind of, we're not allowed to do that, are we? Uh, but go to my Facebook page, which is Carol, C-R-O-L, Roach, R-O-A-C-H-E, like cockroach, but not. Right, next kit. Stunning, stunning, stunning kit. Please don't forget, at about 11 o'clock, we've got a clearance section coming up. We are super duper duper excited about that. It's gonna be amazing. Um, this kit's beautiful, really beautiful. Two strands. Two strands of delicious abalone. Abalone shell. Absolutely gorgeous. Each one of these strands, each one of these gemstones is unique. And you know what's so good about this? A lot of strands that I've seen in the past, not on Jewelry Maker, thank goodness, but abalone um, isn't a gemstone which looks the same on both sides. The outside of an abalone shell looks very different to the inside of an abalone shell. So a strand of abalone really should be beautiful and colorful on one side and a bit dark on the other side, yeah? No, because what we've done here is we've got abalone, I wonder if I can show you like the, the, the sections. You've got abalone, then like a little sandwich of resin, and on the back, abalone. So you're gonna be getting abalone, sandwich, more abalone, okay? So you've got a double-sided abalone strand. Believe you, and, uh, believe you and me, that is not always the case when you buy abalone. But here, you're always gonna be getting that double-sided quality, unless otherwise stated, okay? You're always gonna be getting that double-sided quality. So abalone, on both sides of each one of these beads. Absolutely gorgeous. Square and round, sorry, square and coin shaped beads. Absolutely gorgeous. You're then gonna be getting this. Now I wanna find out actually, is this, rose gold plated, oh my word. Rose gold plated, sorry, I'm looking at the details up at the screen. Rose gold plated, copper spiral diamond link chain now you're getting a 34 centimeter chain here the links are approximately 25 millimeters in diameter don't you think these gemstones work particularly well with this chain you are going to be amazed at the design that janet has created using the abalone predominantly square abalone and the chain it is absolutely amazing what she's done you're going to love the designs it, it, it works so beautifully so Two strands of gemstones and your very own rose gold plated copper um, diamond link chain. Threading pack with monofilament beading thread and elastic. And here we go. Rose gold plated copper findings, 115 of them in total. <whistles> oh, sorry, not gonna whistle. <laughs> Don't whistle! It makes Janet feel sick if you whistle. It makes her feel sorry. Ill. It's all right, sweetheart. No, I'm sorry. You will be sorry. <laughs> Rose gold plated copper chains. Uh, uh, what's this? Finding. Pack. 115. Oh, blimey. Should we just move on? You've then got 10 meters of 0.4 uh, millimeter gauge copper uh, wire and 10 meters of 0.8 millimeter gauge copper wire as well. 20 meters of wire. Two strands of gemstones, beautiful diamond link chain, which you're gonna love how she's incorporated this into their designs. 115 findings in total and a threading pack. It's gonna be a great price point. It's gonna be an amazing price point. 21 pounds 95p. She's not staying there. You ain't seen nothing yet. Dun, dun. But baby, baby, you ain't seen nothing yet. 1995. It's amazing, it's amazing. Get it in your basket. Check it out. It's 1990, 1995. Oh, yeah! You ain't seen nothing yet. It's amazing, isn't it? Under 20 pounds. What a fantastic kit. What a fantastic price. Janet, this is, this is a chance. <clears throat> This, see, this kit has given you a, the chance to make the most incredible pieces, hasn't it? Can you see why I said that 
They were just absolutely beautiful. It's been so well thought out, this kit, hasn't it? Amazing. Who's put this kit together? Was it Pip? Pip, I think. Oh, yeah. Pip. Come and take a bow. Come on, Pip. Come and take a bow. It, it, it just. Come on. Amazing. It's absolutely delicious. Pip, are you going to come in? Come on, Pip. Pip put this kit together. Oh, he's looking so summery. He's a star, isn't he? He's gorgeous, isn't he? Here yeah. he is. Here he is. Dana, 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 da 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 <laughs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> High five. Um, <laughs> tell us about this kit, Pip. Why did you put this kit together? Because um, I like abalone. You like abalone? That's why. Just because I love it so much that I wanted to put it in a kit. <laughs> but it was genius putting it with the chain. For me, mm -hmm. it was genius because the shapes just went together and it was just perfect. Again, he just told me what to do with it. Yeah. Have I you seen the necklace? Look at that. Yeah, that's why I just thought the shapes went really well together. Yeah. So really, I love it. Mm -hmm. well yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Pip. Well done. You're in the right place at the right time. I know, right? It's like, it's like we keep you in a box or something and get him out. Get him out! Get him out! Um, this is an absolutely astonishing necklace. Can I show you the earrings as well? I think I might be wearing those. Look at this! Do you know what, Janet? I, I, I've almost forget about the other pieces of jewelry in this kit. I just yeah. love those two. I just, I just want yeah. those two. Those were the first pieces that I did. I'm not surprised. Because as soon as I opened it, I thought the chain, I knew exactly what I was going to do. So that was the first piece that I did. Look how much jewellery Janet's managed to make from this kit. Look at it all. One, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Fourteen pieces of jewellery with a kit that gives you two strands of gemstones a 34 centimetre um, um, uh, diamond link chain, 115 findings, a threading pack. It's amazing. Absolutely gorgeous, this kit. <gasps> Little startup peppers, look at the ring. Beautiful ring. Is that what we're gonna see the demo one? We're I can't gonna remember. Demo this one. <gasps> Three rings in a kit. Three coins in a fountain. <laughs> we're actually gonna see a demonstration on this incredible ring right here. I could look at this jewellery all day, it's absolutely beautiful. But having that chain as an addition to the kit, that just helps it to go that much further. Doesn't it, just? Yeah. Oh, look at those earrings. And they are beautiful. And the necklace on the end is just the this chain one, yeah. and chain. And um, I've sort of squished down the chains to sort of make them more diamond shaped. Just yeah. So, just so you've got that bit of difference in there. But it and looks that, stunning on its own. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? And that chain on its own, that looks like that could be the added extra, you know, that, that is a chain that you get in the kit, but you get so much more of it. I can see it in yeah. all these pieces here. We're gonna have to get into a demo because as you can see, people are rushing in to buy this kit. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, I really want that set of jewelry. It's so beautiful. Right, okay, how do we make this ring then, Janet? Okie dokie. So um, we use the point eight. Just take a length of the point eight. Um, I don't know, 15, 16 inches, something like that. Of course you get wired with this kit as well. Yeah. Blimey. It was, um, and that's what I mean. The three I've had today have been, so far, my favourites. Good. Because they were absolutely amazing. Right, so take a piece of wire, get your ring mandrel, um, decide what size that you want, wrap it around, there you go. Wrap it around the ring mandrel once, so you're back up to the top section. And then, just bring the pieces together and give as close to the mandrel as you can and give it a little twist. There, so you've got twisted over there. Gorgeous. And then all we're gonna do is wrap around, trying to keep that as flat as you can. Lovely. So that we get that little rosette shape in the middle. And I know this has been shown sort of before. So we just keep doing that until you've got a section in the center there that there you go sorry gorgeous that you've um that you, you're happy with the size of mm -hmm. just keep going around there so once you're happy with the size of the rosette in the center straighten those out a bit you almost don't need any gemstones on this no you could actually just sort of tie that off from there and there and you've got a pretty little ring there yeah um but what i did from there so we've got one piece of wire going that way keep the other one across sorry that way then, 
start threading on the gemstone. So put one gemstone onto one side. That idea of not using any gemstones was Ollie's, by the way. He's just told me to come up with my, says come up with your own ideas, Carol. That was my idea, fine. Mm. Sorry, Ollie, it was, your, it was Ollie's <laughs> idea. Happy? Right. I've actually got too much, much wire here, so I'll, I'll snip off a little bit of that just so I can show you. There, so thread on a gemstone and you've Gorgeous. got that here. So just bring that into where you want. It's re really easy. I feel a bit of a fraud actually showing you this because it's so easy. So, um, put it on there. Just Do it standing on your head, make it look more difficult. Okay, on one leg. Right. On one leg. I'm on one leg now. <laughs> there you go. Um, and then bring it round so that this wire then crosses over the shank. And then simply bring that around, wrap it around a couple of times. Try and keep that as tight and as neat as you can. And basically that's that's one side. Gorgeous. And then you just repeat that on the other side. And the point eight went through both strands, no you know, with no issues or anything. So the holes in them are quite generous. Again, I'll snip that off just to show you. Gorgeous. Quickly. There you go. So Look then at that. wrap that around. Do it a bit slower than me and a bit sort of neater. Snip. Oh, sorry, Kerry. Did you manage Catch. to get Kerry with that one? I no, don't think not you did. quite. No. Nah, better and me. then just pinch in the um, the little sharp edges so you've got no no sharp bits. And then look at is that beautiful? Ring. I'd probably do that a little bit tighter. Probably move it over a little bit. It's so simple. But that's it. Simple, simple, simple. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. I've got one for me. Look now. at that. 14 pieces of jewellery. Fantastic, guys. Do you know the gamble would say? 14 pieces of jewellery. I know. One, yeah, that does, yeah, that works out to about £1.20 per piece. That's ridiculous, isn't it? Probably even less than that, actually. That's ridiculous, isn't it? £1.42 per piece of jewellery. Do you pay £1.42 for that? So My you, goodness me. If you're selling your jewellery, it's a profit maker. Definitely. Pro profit all the way to the bank. Are we going to go to the Wall of Fame? Let's go to the Wall of Fame and see some of your incredible pieces of jewellery. Lovely. You love my singing, don't pretend I you do, don't. I do, I do. I sing along at home. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, number 383. This is from Eleanor Hawkins, who's in Barcelona. Barcelona. Who says, hi, please find a touch my design for this week's Wall of Fame. This is my first attempt as a bridal fascinator slash comb, a taking inspiration from one of the other, sorry, one of the older episodes from your YouTube channel from last year with Gemma Crow. I've used citrine and smoky quartz nuggets and three types of pearls along with a golden comb and gold plated 0.4 millimeter gauge wire all from Jewelry Maker. I'll be wearing it this weekend for a friend's wedding. Would love a win so that I can get more pearls and wire, please. I love making this um, and I've already started another. Good luck to everyone else. Eleanor Hawkins, isn't that fantastic from Barcelona? Oh, have fun at that wedding. Isn't that pretty? Mm, beautiful. Mm -hmm. Oh, this look is, at the soft lighting on isn't this. It? This is 380. Oh, I like the earring stand that she's made as well. Oh. Yeah. 380, and this is from Laura Richardson. And Laura says, morning to all you lovely mad people at JM Towers. I've been very busy this week creating my second wall of fame entry, so hope you like it. It's absolutely beautiful. Uh, it's a mixture of fluorite stars uh, and rounds, clear quartz necklace, and it comes complete with fluorite and rope spacer ring bracelet, and a, a really cute pair of fluorite earrings. All the materials are from yourselves, of course. He's hoping for a win, and good luck to everyone um, for the draw. Love and jewellery maker kisses uh, to all the presenters, crew, and guest designers. That's from Laura. That's gorgeous. And I like the little um, earring stand that she's made as well. Isn't it lovely? Boy. That's really you are cute. clever. Well done. Number 382. This is absolutely gorgeous. I think these are the B World Pearls mm. that we bought you the other day. Uh, from Charlotte, who's from London. Good luck to everyone. Thank you for giving us such a brilliant deals with your beautiful gemstones. I love pearls, but could not have afforded them without your excellent prices that have allowed me to make uh, what I was uh, to make what was only in my imagination before. That's awesome. Thank you so much for that. Um, 
I hope you like this design. All the pearls are yours. Well, they're not, they're yours now, but they're from Jewelry Maker, of course. And backing is uh, made from your silver plated wire and a toggle clasp. Wishing you all a great day. And that's from Charlotte. That is an absolutely beautiful piece of jewelry. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at how all those yeah. pearls kind of interlock. Yeah, like all the pearls on top of the pearls as well. Yeah, the layers pearls on pearls. pearls. You can't get any better, really, can you? Gorgeous. And this is 379. <gasps> and this is from Anita in Liverpool. And Anita says, hi, ladies. Here is uh, this week's Wall of Fame entry. A rose quartz bracelet with silver and coloured spacers. Everything except the coloured spacers are from JM. And that's love from Anita in Liverpool. Well done, Anita. Thank you. Really pretty. Oh, this is that. amazing. Oh, my word. Did you see the show the other day with Alison where she made the wire work shoe? She's a wizard, isn't she? She is, she is a wizard. She's a genius. Number 381. Look at this. This is from Hannah. Today I watched Alison demo the wire work she did on the shoe. I was so blown away by how it looked, I had to give it a go. I've not gemmed it up yet, but look, uh, but it looks amazing already. It does, it is absolutely, a st that is incredible. What a brilliant way to jazz up shoes. Uh, love, uh, love it. Thank you, Alison, you're amazing. That's from Hannah. Hannah, you've done an amazing job there. Have you done the other one or is it just one? I think that's absolutely out of this world. You should be really, really proud of that. I might not even put any gemstones on that. I think it's great just on its own. Amazing, isn't it? Clever, clever lady. That is just incredible. Coming up after the break, we've got the most beautiful strand of genuine green amethyst. Oh, look at this. Look at that, Janet. Ooh, I want that. It's beautiful, isn't it? Uh, this is coming up really, 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 really limited edition. Strands like this always are limited edition because they're so unbelievably special. It's coming up in just a few seconds. Don't go anywhere. The fastest way to shop with Jewelry Maker is by going to our website. Just click on the sign up button. Once you've filled in the required details, you can start shopping. You can watch the show by clicking the watch live button on the front page. You can also use our refine tool and narrow down your search. Once you've found an item that you like, just simply click on the buy now button and the item will be added to your basket. Don't forget you can add as many items to your basket per day and still only pay one p and Enjoy shopping with Jewelry Maker. When shopping with Jewelry Maker, you can add as many items to your order in one day and only pay one postage and packaging charge. We have two delivery options. Standard delivery at just £2.95 and you'll receive your parcel within four to six days. Or opt for our premium delivery at just £4.95 and you'll receive your parcel within three to four days. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker.
Wow, 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 wow. Take a look at the quality you are getting there. Let's just take a second just to look, just to look at the quality, at the faceting you are getting, because that is amongst the best faceting, some of the best quality um, green amethyst I have, I have seen. It is absolutely out of this world. Isn't it stunning? Isn't it glorious? With green amethyst, when it's faceted beautifully, it can look like one of the most beautiful green gemstones in the world. And do you know something? With, with green amethyst, if it's not faceted beautifully, it can be a pretty big disaster, actually. It can be, it can be, it can be, just it could be such a shame um we talk about the three c's sorry, the three c's the four c's sometimes when we talk about genuine gemstones we don't really talk about them much on jewelry maker just purely because of um um purely because we don't normally have either either gem quality gemstones that we would set into precious metal or the gems aren't big enough and they haven't had that much of a cut applied to them this is a prime example of the four C's in action. The four C's being cut, clarity, carrot. Cut, clarity, carrot, and color. Thank you, sorry. Um, oh, was it on screen? I was closing my eyes trying to remember them. <laughs> sorry, I was going, oh, cut, pressure, pressure. Um, when we talk about um, diamonds, you want to have impossible, you know, beautiful, impossible clarity. You want to have as little colour as possible from the actual gemstone, but you want to get loads of fire. So in a way, you do want colour from the gemstone. When you talk about carrot weight, well, often when we're talking about gemstones which are faceted to set into genuine gemstone jewellery, you know, part of our Larique collection um, um, or a diamond ring, we want to talk about you know how big the gemstone is how it's been faceted for beauty and not for carrot weight because that is the important thing lapidrist um there is a there is a uh, um there is a, an easy trap to fall into when you're faceting a gemstone and that trap is faceting for carrot weight and not beauty because there's a magic number when you facet gemstones um so a magic number could be uh, the carrot weight is um, the carrot weight is five carats. Well, you might find a lapid just really trying to squeeze out every single point of that gemstone so it measures five carats. Even if the gemstone would look much much more beautiful if it was four point seven two carats, you know. With gemstones like this, they have obviously been faceted for beauty and not for carrot weight. And that is the way we operate here at the Genuine Gemstone Company. We facet it for beauty and not for carrot weight. Um, I say this whenever I bring you a great quality strand of green amethyst, the quality you are getting here, the color you are getting here, the brilliance you are getting here um, is likened for me to one of the most famous gemstones in the world, the Dresden diamond. I've got a picture of it right here. This is a picture of the actual Dresden diamond, which is, I believe, the world's largest uh, natural faceted green diamond. It is absolutely beautiful. Can you see that silvery green color that you're getting out of this? It is exactly the same color that you get from this strand of green amethyst. This silvery green quality clarity is absolutely out of this world. When you concave facet a gemstone like you've done here, you make Cutting a gemstone, very, very tricky indeed. Concave faceting can only be applied by hand. All these gemstones have been, have been faceted by hand anyway. When you concave facet a gemstone, what are you doing? Okay, well, you are physically cutting down the pavilion, which is the slanty bit of the gemstone. You are cutting down the gemstone. So you are making, rather than the side facets, a cross section of the side facet looking like that, of the pavilion looking like that, it looks like that almost like a corrugated roof. I know that sounds very a very crude thing to say, but almost like a corrugated roof, right down the size of the gemstones. What does that do? Okay, can you see inside this gemstone, you're getting almost a vanishing point. Can you see that? How those side facets, they're not pure and they're not, it's not one lot of light you're looking at there. It's like shards of light. That is what happens when you concave facet a gemstone. The great thing about this particular strand 
is that both sides of the gemstone have been concave faceted. So this side, as you can see, can you see that luster coming from the surface of the gemstone? Yeah, exactly the same on the other side. This, I think, is the first strand of gemstones I've ever bought you on Jewelry Maker where both sides of the gemstone have been concave faceted. So you're gonna get that, so you're gonna get that kind of, um, you're gonna get that vanishing point on either side of the gemstone, whichever angle you look at it from, which is very, very unusual. Normally it's only the underside of the gemstone which is concave faceted. Both sides have been faceted here, which is very unusual. I've never seen it before. On this strand, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 gemstones on this strand. Now, 10 gemstones on a strand. Just to give you a rough idea, this gemstone, to facet this gemstone, probably each one of these gemstones, each one of these gemstones probably would have taken 25 minutes, half an hour to facet. So collectively, you've got what? Almost five hours worth of faceting just on this one strand. That is the reason why this is a limited edition strand. That is the reason why we can only commission just a few of these. We've only got a few of these strands available because strands like this take so long to put together, so long to facet, so long to get this kind of quality of green amethyst in, that we can only commission a few of these. The price point for this is unbelievable. I think it's very difficult to put a price point on such an amazing strand. Um, this could be, and I think this deserves to be a strand of gemstones that breaks triple figures, you know, high 80s, 90s. In actual fact, it's going to work out to less than a tenner a pendant, less than five pounds a pendant, 49 pounds 95p for sheer perfection, for absolute perfection and I'd never normally use that word about the genuine gemstone unless I would I would I, I'd bet my I bet my presenting career on that that is absolutely that is sheer perfection there is I, I, I the quality is impeccable the faceting has been applied by a by a master craftsman and you can tell that this isn't a strand of gemstones that, um, that, that a lapidus has started to facet on a whim and thought, oh yeah, it looks great if you concave facet it. Oh, let's try the other side. Oh yeah, it looks great if I do it on the other side as well. No, no, no. There would have undoubtedly been a departmental meeting about how we're going to facet this incredible quality green amethyst. How are we going to do this? Okay, well, let's sit down and have a think about it. Let's try concave faceting. Okay, well, why don't we try it on both sides? Because the quality's there, the clarity's there. Why don't we try and do it? Okay, but there's only a couple of lapidus in our cutting house who can actually achieve that quality of faceting. Okay, well, let's give it to them. Okay, well, obviously, we can only commission 50 of this strand. It is absolutely out of this world. And £49, 95p for that quality. Unbelievable. You've got a strand of pendants here, but if you did put it in pendants, I think you would easily, easily be able to charge between 30, 40 pounds each for one of these incredible gemstones. What do you think, Janet? What, what are your thoughts on this strand? I think they're absolutely stunning. And just looking at them, it's just mystical, isn't it? That effect that they give. Yeah. And for me, um, I would make pendant and earrings and you've got your money back and then you've got strand, well, you've got more than your money back, I would say. Yeah, 10 but gemstones on this strand, 10 of them. Absolutely beautiful. This is a, this is a masterclass in how to facet a gemstone, how to get the most out of a gemstone. Stunning quality, isn't it? Well done. Now, coming up now. We've got a cheeky little clearance section for you now. Now, every single deal you are going to see, you'll see the price of what it should be and then the price of what we're going to do it at. We are going to miss, we are going to, we are going to, what? Well, we are going to lose an awful lot of money on these deals, yeah? We've been given special permission by management, ma management to take these prices, I can't speak today. We, we've been given special permission by management to take these prices low. We are going to go into negative margin. We are going to lose money on pretty much every single deal you are about to see. This is a gen these are all genuine clearance offers. So, first clearance offer is on this. Okay, yellow gold plated copper findings, 115 in total. This is the findings pack that's gonna give you this gorgeous twisted curb link chain. Okay, so you're gonna be getting a meter of this. You're gonna be getting these gorgeous earring findings with the flower detail. There you go. You're also going to be getting flower top head pins. There they all are, looking absolutely gorgeous. You're also gonna be getting crimp beads, crimp beads covers, spacer beads. You're gonna be getting um, toggle class, flower connectors. You're gonna be getting um, 
S-link clasps with your extender chains as well, you, we, we are going to end up losing an awful lot of money across these next few deals, okay? You are going to be getting not one or two, you are going to be getting six findings packs. Six findings packs. Why did I just say six? I don't know. Five findings packs. Why did I say six? I've got no idea. Five findings packs. Five 115 gold-plated copper findings packs. Five packs of them in total. So that is 530, 60, 75. 575 findings. That is five meters of chain. Five meters of chain. That's almost as much as we put on our spools. How incredible is that? You are going to be getting five meters of this chain and then hundreds upon hundreds and hundreds of other findings here. What you should be paying today is £49.75p. What you're actually going to be paying today is you've got to get on the phone lines, you've got to get involved on the web. All these deals are going to go really, really, really low. We are going to lose an awful lot of money on all of these. Get it now, get it whilst you can. Not £49.95p, £24.95. And 95p. Absolutely incredible. Get involved when you can. I've got tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of deals like this coming up right here, right now on Jewelry Maker. You've got to make them yours now because we are going to have a load of people missing out. I've got about 15 of you with this in your basket right now. Please check your baskets out. I've got loads and loads of people coming through on the web and the phone lines now. Oh my word. So it should be almost 50 pounds today, less than 25 pounds. How amazing is that? Dion, how's your screen looking at the minute? Is it looking red with minus figures all over it? Yeah, yeah, loads of people coming through. Yeah, there's yellow colors coming up on the screen as well, which means we've got a queue forming on the phone lines as well. Oh my word, I've got dozens and dozens and dozens of you calling through and coming through on our website. That is absolutely wonderful, well done. 24.95 for five findings packs. I'll stand by this until the end of time. I will, I absolutely will do. Our findings packs, I, I haven't experienced anywhere else that can give you as many findings of this kind of quality, which will give you this kind of quality for these kind of prices. £24.95p for five packs of our Yetta Gold Plated Copper Findings. 115 pieces in each pack. You're getting five lots, so that's 575 findings. Patricia from County Durham's coming to get two lots of these. So you're going to get over a thousand findings. That's amazing! £24.95p. Janet, stock, you, you've got to stock up on these, haven't you? Well, at that price, I think uh, as a jewellery maker, you'd be silly not to. If I was at home, I'd be buying them. Yeah. Because, you know, well, I'm not going to say it again, but, but every, you know, every, every jewellery maker out there knows the importance of having findings to hand yep. when you're making a piece of jewellery. So yeah. to have those, you've got a stash already, you know, if, you, if you're just getting going, you're just starting, there you I go, agree. you've got your stash there ready, haven't you? Absolutely. £24.95p for this incredible deal. Well done. Loads of you still coming through. How about the silver ones? Yeah? Uh, different findings on this silver one. And in fact, you're going to be getting the star top head pins. You're going to be getting the um, elongated overlink chain. Still keep going through for this gold plated copper findings pack. You're going to be getting five of these, but it's a different findings pack. So you're getting star top head pins, uh, more elongated overlink chain. What else are you going to be getting? Elongated earring findings. Woo! This awesome, awesome, awesome rope link chain, is, uh, sorry, rope link uh, T-bar clasp as well. Okay, so you're going to be getting five packs in total. Is it going to be a fantastic price point? Yeah, of course it is. Do you want to see the price you should be paying? Should be £34.75p. Not today! Five packs in total. That's 575 silver plated copper findings. Here's your price. You're gonna love it. Call us now. Get involved on our website, jewelrymaker.com. You've experienced the cues already that we've had today. We've been really, 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 really busy on today's show. Add it to your order. Oh, add it to your order. La 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 la. Hey! La 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 la. Hey! 17 pounds 95p. That's amazing. What is that, Ben? It's a amazing. Amazing. <laughs> yeah. 17.95 absolutely fantastic for 575 findings how many findings are you going to be getting this as part of this pack scott 575 thanks scott 575 yeah loads of you with this in your baskets well done chloe how long is your 30-day money-back guarantee 30 days. 
Thanks. <laughs> you can tell her go. <laughs> 30 days, 30 days, it's 30 days. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> Scott, do you want to come and uh, take a bow? T take a bow for these amazing deals. It's a Scott, he put these deals together. Under the oh, graphic, you're under the graphic. graphic. Come on, come on. Ah, we love Scott, the savior of jewelry maker. There he is, ladies and gentlemen, Woo! the savior of jewelry maker. <laughs> Lovely, we love him. Well done, everyone. Dozens of you coming through on the web and the phone lines out. It's amazing. I've got loads of people multi buying as well. I feel like John McCrimmick. I really do. I've got loads of people multi buying. They're coming in to get a good great deal. It's absolutely incredible. £17.95. Oh my goodness, me added to your order. And the final furlong. Is my voice annoying you? It's annoying me. I annoy myself. I do. I annoy myself. Janet's just like, you are just. She's going to write a strongly worded email. I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel it. No. Carol was very unprofessional today. We love you, Carol. Return. I do not want to work with her again. <laughs> return. Please don't let me work with her again. Return, return. Love, Janet. The incessant whistling. Return. When you're angry, that's how you press return. Return! Well done. Look at the quantity bar. This is just out of control. Absolutely wonderful. 575 findings for under 18 pounds. Look at that. 198, 198, 198. There's not 198 left. 198, 198, 195, 193, 192. They're going. Everyone smells really nice today. Everyone who came, everyone who's kind of, everyone who I'm coming into contact with smells really good. Chloe smells lovely. Haven't smelled Ben yet. Um, Janet smells lovely, Scott smells lovely, Dion smells lovely, Ollie smells lovely. I haven't smelt Ryan, I haven't smelt Ryan yet. No, I haven't smelt Ryan. Are you, you gonna break, break the trend there? Ryan just <laughs> smells. Well done everyone, loads of you still coming through with this gorgeous. Well done to Patricia in East Lothian and Patricia in Kent. This is clearly a game for all the Patricias. Well done, Anonymous in Nottinghamshire, you've come into multi-buy, well done. If you do wanna multi-buy anything today, please, 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 now is the time to do it. Open your order, add to your order, get it. I'd definitely multi-buy a deal like this, wouldn't you, Janet? Yes, definitely. Uh, well, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, you're always going to use them. Okay, you're not going to be using them immediately, all of them, but just to have them there in your stash, ready to call on. But don't you think it's just one of those impulse buys that you're genuinely not going to regret? Yes. We've all got impulse buys that we regret, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> this, you're not going to regret this, an impulse buy that you are genuinely not going to regret. You will always, always, always have a use for these. It's so annoying when you're making that bracelet or making that necklace and you run out of findings. It is the most annoying thing in the entire world. Even more annoying than the Safe Style window advert. Even more annoying than that. I know, that's annoying as well. That's pretty annoying. Well done, everyone. 147, 145 chances remaining in the building. Yeah, that's it. Once they're gone, they're gone. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. Stunning. Where are we going next, lovey? We're still going. Still go with the findings, Carol. Don't give up. I'm not going up. Let's have a sip of water. Well done, everyone. How incredible is that? Yes, I'd love to read some text out. I just get bored of my own voice sometimes. Lorna from the West Midlands. I love Crazy Carol. Also, it is impossible to say the word, say the word bubbles angrily. Give it a go. Bubbles. Do you know, that's my nephew's first word, bubbles. Aww. Yeah, it's cute, isn't it? Bubbles, I love it. Fantastic, thanks Lorna, that's gorgeous. Uh, Tina, there are only so many places in the house I can hide JM stuff. <laughs> oh no, have you tried the bread bin? The bread bin's very good, very, very good. Uh, uh, bread bins are actually a lot bigger than you give them credit for. You can fit a lot of stuff, you can fit a pair of shoes into a bread bin. Don't ask me how I know that, I just know. Tanya, wow, I've just got my concave round quartz in the post. Can't stop drooling. Oh dear. Thank you, Joey <laughs> Maker. <laughs> is that because of the gemstones? Hopefully it is. Uh, gorgeous. Isn't that awesome? Uh, Zena, Carol and Janet. Hi, hi, Carol and Janet. Please, can you say hi to my niece, Sarah or Sarah? Oh, what would you say? Is it Sarah or Sarah? Because I'd always say Sarah, but I'd then Sarah, Sarah Elvin's S A R A, oh. and she's Sarah. I don't know. I, I, I don't want to say. I don't want to say the wrong n name. Two Sarah. Yeah. Or, okay, let's do two versions. Say hi to my niece Sarah, who's visiting me from overseas. Uh, we're making jewelry together and loving the show. Thanks, Zena. Zena. Hi, Sarah. Go on. Say hi, Sarah. Hi, Sarah. Okay. Hi, Sarah. Hi, Sarah. There you go. Go 
Oh, I'm Janet. Say hello. <laughs> Getting stage fright. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hi, Mum. Susan from Wiltshire. Now I've got to go out and buy a bread bin. Love to present to Carol. You are so much fun. Oh, no, 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 no. Check, check in the post. Uh, I agree with running out of uh, hiding places in the house. Yeah. Um, okay. Let's let's change the text in. Let's change the text in. Strangest place you've ever hidden jewelry maker stashes. Could go one or two ways, couldn't it? Oh, I've got a good one for you. I saw it on the bill once. I saw it on the bill. You know the bill, the the television show, and uh, and I think they 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 it was like a dawn raid on someone who was smuggling something. He either had guns or he had drugs or something, um, and he'd sellotape them all to the inside of the um, cistern of the loo. You know the loo when you take off the thing at the back. <laughs> Just a thought. Obviously, I'm not condoning any kind of violence <laughs> or anything like that, or or or, or anything like that, but. Good place to hide your jewellery maker stash. Fantastic. <laughs> Wire. Wire. I feel like Tommy Cooper with this. <laughs> Where's the ball? <laughs> Where's the ball? <laughs> oh, Tommy Cooper, what a no. ledge. You're a fan of Tommy Cooper, Janet? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. He was amazing, wasn't Sweetie. he? Sweet. Ah, Right, so you've got your wire here. Oh my word. 10 meters of one mil gauge fuchsia color copper wire. 10 meters of one mil gauge fuchsia color copper wire. 10 meters of one mil gauge fuchsia color copper wire. 10 meters of one mil gauge fuchsia color copper wire. And 10 meters of fuchsia gauge, fuchsia gauge? 10 meters of one mil gauge fuchsia color copper wire. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. 50 meters of wire here. That is a lot of wire. You're gonna get all of this wire. All of it. Doesn't matter how many of these you come in and get, you're only paying one lot of PNP of 2.95 PNP per order. That is it for the whole day. What you should be paying for this deal is 27 pound 25p. You paying that today? No, it's clearance. Today, you are gonna get 50 meters of fuchsia color copper wire all in one mil gauge. Here is your price. Ooh. Mm. That's better than half price, isn't it? Cheeky, cheeky. Cheeky, cheeky. And do you know what? I'm not scared about that deal. I'm really, really pleased about that because Scott, our manager, Scott Stone, find him on Facebook. He put this deal together. I love it. Absolutely love it. Well done. Five, uh, five spools of fuchsia colored copper wire. One mil engage, 50 meters in total. It's a lot of wire here, Janet. It's amazing, isn't you it? You could do a lot with that, yeah. couldn't you? It's perfect to use on its own. Uh, twist it with the copper wire, would look absolutely nice. fabulous. Nice. Twist it with the blue wire from, from my challenge, that'd look amazing. So yeah. you can just change change the look of it, and it's, it's amazing at that price, 11.95. Can you make your own findings out of one mil gauge wire? Um, yeah, you can make um, clasps. Um, jump rings, maybe? Jump rings, class. Oh! Yeah. How yeah, fantastic is that? This is honestly, these deals are clearance. We've got minus figures all over our screens. The screen's gone red. I don't care though, because the managers have given us uh, permission to do all these incredible deals. Claire from Derbyshire. I encouraged my son to move out. Oh dear. Uh, so I could use his room as a craft room. Okay, <laughs> okay. Bad mother, he's only 12. <laughs> He's actually 20. Okay, well that's fine. That is fine. I like your style. I'm not that bad a mother. Yes, move out. Why don't you just go and live somewhere else? He's 20. Yeah, come on, on your bike, on your bike. Uh, Kim from Bedfordshire. Stash it behind the bath panel. There's loads of room and they'll never find it. I like it. I like it, unless, unless we moved into our house, and, and this really annoys me, we moved into our house as a new house, okay, so no one else had lived there before. Um, the, the front, the side of the bath came off, you know, the side of the bath on the side, you know, and then underneath the bath, it, there's like an open space. No, no, not under our bath. All the junk, all the bits of, all the bits of um, wood, I think there was even an empty cigarette packet underneath the, 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 the builders had shoved underneath the bath. Really annoyed me. Really annoys me. Can you? Oh, no one cares. 
No one cares. I care. Anyway, oh, thanks, Jan. Thanks, Janet. What do you mean we're going again? What? Fifty meters of. What are you doing? Hey, hey! I know Scott's in there. Whoa! What are you not laughing about in there? They're just having too much of a good time. That's what it is. They are having too that's much of a good just, time in there. That's that's silly, isn't it? Nine ninety. Are you serious? Nine ninety-five for fifty meters of one mil gauge fuchsia colour copper wire. That is absolutely out of this world. What a treat! Oh my word! So all of you. All of you who've come in to get this incredible deal today, if you came in at 11.95, you're not paying 11.95, every single one of you pays just 9.95. How awesome is that? Well done, every single one of you. I love it. Scott, uh, Scott Stone, find him on Facebook. He can't go back to the office now. He's got to sit in there, hide in shame. Scott Stone, the savior of uh, jewelry maker. Hold on. Fantastic, well done. We've got some more text messages through. D in Yorkshire. Uh, Carol, I hide mine underneath the ironing. I hate ironing, and the what? The, oh, the basket is always overflowing, and the husband never goes near it. Well, there you go. That's great. I like this. I like this. This is this is good. Natasha from Conway uh, had to hide my parcel from uh, Jewelry Maker a month after promising my husband I would calm down. <laughs> the only place was under the babe, under the. Under the baby. How is it? You hid your jewelry maker stash under your child. I can't condone that. I can't condone that. Can I? oh, dear me! You're going crazy. Everyone's going crazy. Sean, unfortunately, I can hide anything uh, with my cleaning products. My husband would never yeah. think of going there. Well, yeah. True. I always find the, uh, the um, if you've got an airing cupboard, airing cupboard's a good place to hide things. Unless it's an ice cream, because then it would just melt. <laughs> Unless it needs to be cold. <laughs> Unless it's a jug of ice water. Uh, we've got there, hide your jewelry stuff at my mum's. Ah, I take it, uh, I take home what I need. I'll never know the extent of our addiction. I like that. So all those people who've just built lean-tos and things like that, you're actually building just, just... Or you could build like an internal wall, couldn't you? Like a wall within a wall. A, a fake wall. You could have a whole room, a safe room, couldn't you? Or a what's safe it? room! Yeah. Panic room. I have mine sent to my son's home. Uh, so, when he, so, when, so when he comes over, it's like Christmas. I like that. Yeah! City from Oklahoma says that. Thank you very much. Uh, another one here. Sure we can. Jewelry makers are very sneaky. Babies are not off limits. Oh my word. <laughs> I'm not going to comment on that. That sounds quite frightening, doesn't it? You're going crazy over this tech subject, by the way. Uh, the drawers in my king size divan are full. Both sides start into my daughter's bed now. I'd love to come to some of your homes. I really would do. I reckon that you, you'd literally, you open the door, ah, and gemstones are just coming out the door. Dear me. You've got a room dedicated to making your pieces, don't you? I right, have, Janet? yeah. Very nice. I've got, um, well, it's a cellar room, um, but yeah. So I've got a cellar. How fantastic. That's nice, isn't it, hey? Having your own room, jewelry maker room. Right, what are we doing now, Lovey? These. <laughs> okay, genuine clearance. The deal you're about to see for this. Are we able to change those graphics at all to OMG clearance? I don't know, probably not. Doesn't matter. It, it, yeah, the silence does speak volumes. Uh, the deal we're going to bring you now is bonkers. And I do mean bonkers. Um, we're all up for great deals here on Jewelry Maker. And uh, Dion, who's producing today, will go as low as she possibly can do. Clearance deals are brilliant because, of course, our managers put them together. They kind of set the price point. Uh, not for the last one, because we did that even lower than, than the manager said we could do, but we don't really care, to be fair. Um, and we love bringing you clearance deals 
because it means you get something at a really fantastically reduced price. The deal you're about to see though is a deal that I heard a couple of managers talking about upstairs the other day. I didn't know it was going to be on today's show, but I heard them talking about this. Fact of the matter, uh, the fact of the matter is at the minute, we've ordered all of our Christmas pieces. They're going to arrive soon and we need somewhere to put them. Our, we, uh, our, our vault, our warehouse is so full at the minute that we are having to do clearance deals on a lot of our bigger pieces. So big display bus, gift boxes, things like that. Okay. These aluminium beads are going to go down to the kind of price point which is going to make your eyes pop out, honestly. You're going to be getting 50 of these gorgeous mocha and silver coloured aluminium beads. I, I think these are so awesome. I think they're so beautifully decorative. Look at them. I love the way they're carved, don't you? Look at that. Doesn't that look awesome? It's like an optical illusion. Like a mocha and truffle um, and, and, and silver coloured aluminium bead. 50 of these, they're absolutely gigantic, yeah? They're brilliant, aren't they? I've seen these used in so many different ways in Christmas decorations. I've seen them used as um, um, accessories around the home. I've seen them used, um, obviously, in jewellery, Shambhala style bracelets, macrame, kumahimo. Um, they look absolutely amazing. You're then going to be getting 50 of these in like a copper or rose gold and silver coloured quality. Again, same kind of size. So exactly the same size. 50 of these. Okay, I'm going to move these over because there's even more. And you're also going to be getting 50 of these in blue and silver. So exactly the same size, same shape, 50 of the blue ones. Now, can I be really honest with you? When we ordered these, we ordered too many. Purely by mistake, we ordered way, 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 way too many packs of these. And by that I mean um, the equivalent of instead of ordering a hundred packs, we ordered a thousand packs. You know, that kind that kind of a boo-boo. Yeah. These beads were not cheap for us to buy. They were not inexpensive for us to buy. In fact, quite the reverse. Because of the amount of time and energy that goes into creating these beads because of the carved quality because of the color quality because these are the big 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 aluminium beads that we can supply you um, they are more expensive for us to be able to source when we ordered these we ordered way 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 too many the deal we're going to offer you right now the deal we're going to offer you now as a member of staff I would not be able to get these aluminium beads for the price we're going to offer you today. This is what you should be paying today for all of these beads. 150 of our largest truffle and silver, rose gold colour and silver and blue and silver aluminium beads. Okay, £24.85p. That is what price I so that, that is the price these should be. As a member of staff, I'd be able to get a bit of a discount because I work for the Genuine Gemstone Company and I'd expect that, yeah? Um, you were about to see jewellery maker lose an awful lot of money. And I cannot prepare you enough for just how low this price is. This is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. I've got dozens I've got dozens of you on the phone lines. Do you know what? Before, okay, Dion's just input the price and has just pre and I just clicked on return to confirm the price. The computer came up with an error message saying, are you sure you want to take this down to the price? Honestly, I kid you not, the error message just came up. Are you sure you want to do this price? It, it, it's a way of preventing producers going too low with margin, too low with price. But honestly, it said, are you sure you want to go to this price point? She's hit yes. I cannot even begin to tell you how much money Jewelry Maker is about to lose. You do the math. What?
I've got sweaty palms. I've got... There is not a lot you can say about that, is there? That is less than a third of the original price. <clears throat> <laughs> Everyone's, all the team members are saying goodbye, Carol. It's been fun working with you. Honestly, th th this is like a gross misconduct price. This is like a hung, drawn and quartered price. What do you reckon, Janet? <clears throat> What can you say? Six six ninety five. I would get them, and uh, I would decorate my Christmas tree with them. To be honest, so would I. Yeah, I'd make um, I'd make Christmas decorations with them, because that's absolutely beautiful, um, and the way they're cut and that, they're just amazing at that, that price. One hundred and fifty. That's they that's should a crazy be price. Twenty four pounds ninety five p. Today. Six ninety five today. We lose an awful lot of money today. You get an unspeakable deal. What's happened to the uh, screen in front of you, Dion? It's just filled up. Names. I've got so many people coming through. You are losing it. <laughs> OMG, just ordered three lots. Amazing. Jacqueline's got two. Patricia's got two. Jean's got two. Uh, Gagenda's got two. Agnes has got two. Mary's got two. Catherine's got two. You do realise when you order two packs, you're actually going to get 300, not 150. It's 300. 300 of these beads if you come in to get two lots of these. You've got, you are going crazy over these. And do you know what? That is astonishing astonishing whether it's macramo whether it's kumahimo whether it's um whether it's making christmas tree decorations as janet suggested whether it's um sewing these onto cushions whether it's sewing them onto bags who cares how you use them you're getting something for pretty much nothing should be 24.95 today and until 9 a.m tomorrow morning 6.95 the beautiful quality you're going to be getting here, it, it is absolutely, look, look at this, look at that, look at that carved cut quality, they are so beautiful. So you're getting 150 of this gorgeous blue, 150 of the kind of uh, rose gold colour or copper colour and silver, yum 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 yum, and then 150 of these bad boys, this kind of truffly coloured, oh, I love those, they're gorgeous. It's lovely you get your precious metal colours in here as well, isn't it? Really, really nice. Gorgeous quality there. Absolutely amazing. As you can see, these are going very, very, very quickly indeed. It doesn't surprise me at all. It's 150 beads here, which should be close to £25 today. Under £7. There is a big, 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 big queue on the phone lines. There's actually over a two-minute wait on the phone lines at the moment. Please do be patient. It is a free phone number from a BT landline. And if you do want to get involved on our website, uh, jewelrymaker.com, that is our web address if you want to add to your order that way instead of uh, giving us a call on our free phone number. Uh, Sissy, centerpieces for Kumihimo designs. Done. Like it. Like it. Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, Sue from South Yorkshire. Uh, all very well hiding. We have a joint account and, oh, and the internet banks. Oh, not many things you can do to hide that, is there? Yeah. I don't know. Penny. Uh, hi, Carol. I'm lucky. I don't have to hide my, uh, m my buys. My gemstones don't take up as much room as my fiance's fishing tackle. Uh, if he wants, if he wants a wall for space, it's on. Yeah, do you know what? That's good. My husband's got a motorbike. I don't think I'm ever going to have to kind of... I'm always going to be the winner. Yeah. I'm always going to be the winner. Um, I get my friend to order mine. Ah, then bring it home when my partner is at work and add it to my stash. If he says he hasn't seen it before, I just say, 
Of course we have. <laughs> um, I've had it ages. Do you know, I've used that so many times on my husband. Oh, this old thing. Uh, he's had a bad memory, so never knows the difference. Uh, Wendy in Norfolk. Wendy, that is slightly cruel that you're taking advantage of your poor um, uh, partner's poor memory, but, uh, but fair play. You're well organized, aren't you? Well organized. Uh, Michelle, um, I don't have to hide my jewelry maker parcels. My husband always tells me if I want it, I can have it. Oh, oh, it'll be lucky me, but my craft, uh, but my craft what? Corners uh, getting bigger. Yeah, you see, that's it. That's it. It's going to stop being so, it's going to stop being so, um, it's going to stop being so sympathetic after a while. When your craft corner becomes a craft room and a craft house. Yeah. It's going to take over the world. Carol, is it 50 of each you sold? 150 of each. No, 50 of each. 50 of each colour, but 150 in total. 150 in total, 50 in each colour. Blimey, every third order goes to my mother-in-law uh, who has slight dementia. She can't... Oh, no. Right. Right, I think enough of those texts now. Oh, my word. <laughs> Got you started. Hey, how do you... I, did, I, did I actually start it? Um... Yeah. <laughs> I think. Shame on all of you, honestly. Dear me. <laughs> right, okay, so well done to all of you there. 6.95, there's still 156 chances. Another text, my word. <sighs> I take care of the checkbook, uh, checkbook so jewel maker is another utility bill. <laughs> well, yeah, it's an essential, isn't it? Heating, water, council tax. Jewelry definitely fits into that category. Right, that's it for the clearance deals, yeah? That's it for the clearance deals, yeah? What do you mean, no? I need to lie down. I need to lie down. Have these gone on my figures, by the way? Oh, no. Oh, no. Hang on. I can't. Oh, they're all going on the floor. Sorry, Chloe. And that's why you need a sticky mat. <laughs> eh? That's why you need a sticky mat. Thank you, Janet. Yes, that's why I need a sticky beading mat. <laughs> right. <clears throat> now, I've got a deal now. No, I'll do it. Oh, no, I'll do it. Dear me. Wish you the camera work as well. Dear me, I'll tell you what. Mix them all up for you. You've got to separate them all out now. <laughs> <laughs> right, now. My attitude stinks. <laughs> She's pregnant, we can't shout at her. Oh, great. Well, that's just fantastic. Thanks for that, Dion. Before I even open my mouth to tell you the first thing about the chairs, by the way, Carol, we're already losing money on this deal. Great. Thanks. Even at the starting price. Brilliant. Brilliant. It's all good news then. Awesome. <laughs> now, um, we are, seriously, the deal that we're, the starting price of this, we're actually, we're actually losing money on this already. <laughs> a couple of years ago, I was lucky enough to go to uh, uh, Jaipur with Jewelry Maker to visit our Jewelry Maker studios out there with Chloe. Give us a wave. Come on. Here she is, here she is. Hi. With Chloe, who's head of production. Um, we had the most amazing time, didn't we, over in India? You had a great time, but what? You were quite hard. To I was hard work. Great. Thanks a lot for that, Chloe. <laughs> we had a great time, didn't we? Yeah. We got a bit drunk on the first night, though. <laughs> Wake up the next morning going, ah. Uh, uh, anyway, so we were lucky enough to go to the Pink City. Uh, Jaipur is known as the Pink City um, because it was painted pink. Um, basically, um, um, in preparation for Queen Elizabeth II's uh, visit to Jaipur years ago. There I am. That was, it was hotter than the sun there. It was so hot. And I, believe it or not, I was surrounded by goats. I was surrounded by goats. I was surrounded by goats. Going, I was surrounded by goats. There's an elephant. Hi. Uh, anyway, fantastic time in Jaipur. Actually in the old city. So within the, um, actually within the walls of the original uh, pink city, there is um, a really, really small outfit. Uh, oh, there are the pink walls. Uh, run by a guy called Rami, and I can't remember the other guy. I can't remember the other guy. 
But we filmed a bit of footage on top of their, on, on top of their um, um, uh, workshop. And in this workshop, they make these backwards driving. You are so silly. Hey, I'm trying to tell everyone about these beads. Right. Actually, in this workshop, they make these copper beads. We had these copper beads in stock um, on Jewelry Maker before I went over to Jaipur. And I remember looking at these copper beads and appreciating them for what they were, thinking, oh yeah, they're absolutely gorgeous, they're brilliant, um, they're absolutely fantastic, I'm loving the price point. Um, but it was actually only when I went to see these beads being made that I actually appreciated just what kind of a process this is to make them. They're all handmade, all handmade. So you've got, you've got big sheets of copper big, 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 big sheets of copper. Those sheets of copper are then cut down into kind of ruler size slices, okay? Those ruler size slices are then by hand put into a punch and, the, and you literally pull the handle down and you, and you punch the whole, uh, punch, punch the, um, uh, the, the strip of copper, the shape of the bead that you want it to be. So it could be heart shape, it could be octagonal, it could be square, it could be oval, it could be round, whatever it is, okay? You then have a flat piece of copper. You then put it over the top of a, um, over the top of a, um, of like a, a stencil. You then punch it again to get the shape of the bead that you want it to be, okay? Still, it's quite ugly at this point. It's just a piece of copper, okay? Then what happens? The two sides of the bead are stuck together with adhesive. They're then soldered together by hand, okay? Then comes the really amazing part. Then comes the really amazing part. They're put onto temporary strands of wire, just like, um, just like low quality wire. And say 20 of them are on a strand and they're just like hung, like clothes out to dry on a, on, on, on a washing line. They're dipped into a solution which is called a degreasing solution to take any kind of grease and dust and um, debris off the beads. They're then put into water. They're then put into um, a solution which fires uh, electrodes at the beads. This is how you get the plated quality. This is how you get the precious metal plated quality, okay? You then degrease them again and follow the process again. Then they have to be baked. The whole process takes hours, hours and hours and hours just to create this one bead. They're all handmade and the pride that is taken over making these is sensational. It, it's, it's really, really palpable. Now, the price we're about to show you for all these beads, and you are going to be getting 25 of these beads in total, the price we're about to show you is the price you would be paying. £22.25p for all of these 25 beads. We are already, we are already at a loss. We are already losing money. And that price there, you might have seen that price before because that is already a clearance price, okay? Nothing in it for us. We're going lower. We are going lower. We are going lower. 20. In there. Paula Bennett, head of channel finder on Facebook. What are you doing? I like your dress. <laughs> what are you doing? That dress is gorgeous. That won't work. What do you mean that won't work? She looks gorgeous today, doesn't she, Paula? I kid you not. <laughs> oh no, she's coming out. Ooh. She's got Scott by the ear. I love it. <gasps> <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Honestly, that that price made me repel from the desk. <gasps> Have you seen these being made? Have we got any footage of these being made? They are handmade gold flash plated copper beads. That's an insane price. Kim, you're not helping. I know. I know. I know all of this. Sissy from Oklahoma. Is smoke coming out of your computers? Have these low prices? I know, I know, I know. I've seen these beads being made. I have some of these. They're gorgeous, says Jill. Oh, Janet. I've got some of those. Do you? What have you done with Stunning. them? Just simply put them on some chain. Lots and lots of them. Long necklace. Easy, I think that's easy exactly what um, Hannah Osborne's done, actually. She's made a suite of jewellery, just putting loads of these on chain. That's crazy. Oh, Carol, I wasn't going to buy anything today. Well, if you don't want to buy, don't watch, basically. Because that is insane but we've got people texting in that's a p45 price i know it's been lovely knowing you everyone thank you and good night <laughs> p45 oops love it we need a replay of carol's reaction that was gold <laughs> honestly genuine reaction that was i'm not that good an actor honestly that kind of it made me repel At £22.95, that is a loss. At £6.95, that's, I better get down the job centre. It really is. I know. Oh, my word. This shouldn't be called Jewelry Maker anymore. I think this false representation just be called Jewelry Trasher. That is absolutely one of the most stupid deals I've ever seen on Jewelry Maker, ever. That is the stupidest deal I've ever seen on Jewelry Maker. It's got to be. Okay. Really? Clearance deals today on the uh, Designer Inspiration Show and on the Late Show this evening as well. Five clearance deals in each show. Right, okay, brand new kit, everyone. Oh, sorry, Chloe. There's one on the floor there as well. I know she's pregnant, I know, I'm trying to... Just can't get back up. Hey, hey, hey! When I, was, when I was pregnant, when I was really heavily pregnant, I was lying in bed to, to roll over in bed. You know how if you want to roll over in bed, you just roll over in bed. It would be a one, two, three and you kind of launch yourself and everything is done with a huh or a huh or a huh you know you know what i mean don't you like you move it oh like that whereas normally it's kind of that was the chair that made that noise by the way <laughs> anyway oh chloe did you set these up in the little heart no i'll show it to you in a minute it's gorgeous right Ow, look at it. Because you love me. Yeah. yeah, I love you too. Right, so gorgeous nuggety, nuggety, nuggeties of beautiful genuine gemstones. Let's have a look at these. Amethyst nuggets. Oh, yum, 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 yum. Yummy, yummy, yummy. I got gemstones in my tummy and I feel like loving you. So you've got beautiful amethyst stunning citrine oh citrine nuggets as well gorgeous um they go together because of course uh, amethyst which is uh heated up to a very high temperature turns into citrine so of course they're going to go together then you've got beautiful prainite long chips lovely lovely a more intense color than your uh than your praseolite than your green amethyst um um but it, it, it goes so beautifully with those other two gemstones, doesn't it? 
Really lovely springtime qualities in here. Put some more oranges or some more browns in there. You, you definitely have uh, an autumnal kit as well. That's really, really lovely. Well done. So three gorgeous strands there. And a threading pack, monofilament beading thread and elastic. Are you talking about our minus figures at the minute? Go on, say again. <laughs> I won't, I won't, I'll, I won't freak out. We're in serious trouble, basically. That's all you need to know. Seriously. We better get our price lashing pants on then, hey? Stunning rose gold plated silver findings here. Absolutely stunning, stunning, stunning. Rose gold plated 95 stunning silver findings, including our legendary heart link chain. This is this has made jewelry maker legendary. It honestly has. Heart link chain, rose gold plated, 95 sterling silver, looking absolutely delicious. Really, really gorgeous. This is a seven inch chain. Uh, the fact that it's rose gold plated, 95 sterling silver, means you're going to be getting a precious metal quality all the way through these findings. So these head pins here, these have such a gorgeous high quality smoothness to them, which of course is because they are precious metal. You're also going to be getting earring findings, toggle clasps, um, um, a toggle clasp, um, uh, uh, lobster claw clasp, jump rings, crimp beads and crimp bead covers and spacer beads as well. Now, gorgeous kit, yeah? Precious metal findings. Okay, so this kit's going to be the most expensive kit of the day, yeah? Yeah, rose gold plated, 95 selling silver findings. What do you mean am I serious? Yeah, I know. So it's going to be the most expensive kit of the day, yeah? What 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 price have we what price have we have for the kits today? What price have we have for the kits today? 20 24? What was it 21? Uh, 21.95, 19.95. Mm -hmm. So this is going to be it's going to be the most expensive kit of the day, yeah? Yeah? Yeah, it's going to be 27.95, yeah? Yeah? Yeah. We're not in the clearance section anymore. You do know that, Dion, yeah? The findings on their own, this findings pack with 43 rose gold plated 95 sterling silver findings, those findings on their own are £14.95p. And then you get three strands of genuine gemstones and a threading pack for a fiver. You get a lot of gemstone quality, don't you? You really honestly do. Isn't that just stunning? £19.95p for all of this. Walk like an Egyptian. Now, Janet has made some beautiful jewellery. It's a good job she's made some beautiful jewellery because what happens to jewellery maker guest designers who don't make beautiful jewellery? They get put <coughs> in the <coughs> workshop room. We've got a... Actually, we've got one in there at the minute. Yeah. Let me out! Let me out! They didn't make good enough jewellery. So we lock them in the workshop room, don't we? Let me out! Let me out! <laughs> Not really, she just hasn't turned the lights on. It's Frankie. <clears throat> Hi, Frankie! I think it's Frankie. Is it Frankie? It is, yeah. yeah. it is Frankie. Hi. Lovely lady. Oh, my word. First of all, Janet. Yes. The price point's ridiculous. <clears throat> Crazy. And the jewellery's gorgeous. Look at how those gems work. They're just beautiful together, aren't they? That is a serious chunk of monker gemstone piece. See what I mean? Today has been my... I keep saying it, but all-time favourite kits. Yeah, Absolutely I totally get amazing. that. Look at this. Just you, stunning nail. We're actually going to see a demo on this in a few moments, how Janet has twisted the beautiful beading thread and threaded gemstones onto it. It's absolutely gorgeous, this technique. It looks stunning. They look like twigs. You know how people kind of wet... Um, it's, it's willow twigs, isn't it? And, yes. then, and, and then they weave with them. It's, yeah. it, it's a little bit like that. It's gorgeous. These gems work together so beautifully. Look at this gorgeous little bracelet here. Really, really lovely. Doesn't really matter what order you put the gemstones in either, does it? They all go all, together. Yeah. They're just absolutely stunning. Aren't they just? So some of the gorgeous citrine to go on this little charm bracelet here. That chain is just amazing. Isn't it beautiful? So I just save some of the, the citrine and just... Yeah. Just and there's bracelet. a clasp. How cool is that? One of the earring findings. Lovely earrings here. And then a beautiful ring at the front with the citrine on. 
and that's the same technique as we're going to show as well so with the technique we're going to show oh. you could do the necklace earrings and the ring perfect how do you do it then janet okie dokie i'll show you the earrings uh -huh. um <clears throat> and then i'll sort of explain how you can just translate it um perfect the okay. earrings to make the earrings we uh, i've added on three of the um gemstones yes in, in whatever combination you want obviously um <clears throat> if you were making the ring you would just put on whichever gemstone you were going to use um and then what i did uh, if you're going to make the ring do this around the ring mandrel um but for the earrings what i did just hold the um just hold them underneath like mm -hmm. that and then wrap that around I did a couple of sides that side and then move over so do three or four times there we go and then just take them so you've got sort of um, there a rough sort of round yeah round shape and then <clears throat> just take the beading thread mm. and wrap it around Ooh. if you wrap one side one way one yeah. beading thread they're, they're in opposite directions Right, one the one way that's actually a bit loose so i would have i would sort of tighten that up a little bit mm -hmm. and then the other one wrap the other way wow that's really simple and it makes a really strong um loop I, I've, I've used this before and i've crocheted around it to make um oh nice different designs so you've got that so you've got beading thread at this end and this end yeah lovely. and then what i did to secure it was simply go one way through the gemstones. Oh, brilliant. You get so much of this beading thread, don't you? 50, yeah. 60 metres of it. Tons and tons use of, it. of it. I mean, I, um, I've used, I use lots and lots and lots and still lots left. Sorry, it's just a bit fiddly to sort That's of all right, it. do it from a distance. So put it through one way and then pull. And there's your three then. Sue from London says, wow, that really gem heavy necklace is stunning, Janet. It is gorgeous, isn't it? Just together, they just all look mm. absolutely amazing. And that's simply just re-threaded. Um, the strands are, are sort of just put onto a thread. And then the three sections in the middle, I did three sort of loops of um, a monofilament. A monofilament, yeah. Clever. And just, um, just tied them around. So it's a really easy technique. It's nice and easy, yeah. Sorry. I'm so how many threads have you got going through those gemstones now? Um, well, there's the main one. Yeah. Then there's, then there's the, the two. Other one. So we've got three. Wow, that's incredible. So we've got three. So what Brilliant. you do is pull that down mm -hmm. and then just sort of shape that up a little bit. Yeah. So you've got that hanging there. There you go. Lovely. And that's your one earring. And then all I did, I, I actually snipped that off and there you go. There. I'm not securing it with anything else. It's Long just going through the gems. Yeah, and I've made earrings with this before and they they sit. There you go. So that's really, really strong. Wow, that's amazing. That's got no crimp beads in it at all, no, no, no jewellery no. glue. No. That's amazing. And, and it holds perfectly. And then you just open up a earring finding. Just drop it, simply drop it onto the earring finding. Yeah. Close it up. And there you've got your earrings oh gorgeous now how do you how do you translate that to making this ring for ring. instance um, if you're doing the ring as i put the gemstones on put the gemstone on and then wrap it around the ring mandrel yeah and do it in exactly the same way and when you've got the size you want slip it off and then wrap around ah and go okay the, do it in exactly the same way and for the necklace i just did three of them mm -hmm. um and then i didn't actually go through the gemstones on that one i tied a knot at the top on the, um, the on the necklace yeah yeah uh, tied a knot but i had longer pieces on there so then i threaded on the gemstones from the pieces that were left from the loops okay so yeah. it's all part of the same yeah so the strands that are coming from the top actually come from the loops wow so it's all part of the same isn't that same fantastic piece. this is such an awesome kit you're getting three massive strands of gemstones um you've got your threading pack and then you've got rose gold plated 925 sterling silver findings silver precious metal findings and it's all for less than 20 pounds that is a that is a, a clearance price on this gorgeous kit that it's is absolutely stunning, astonishing yeah amazing please do check your baskets out i've only got 12 of this kit left i've got around about 12 of you on the web actually you haven't checked your baskets out please do check your baskets out so you can guarantee that you get this kit it's gorgeous isn't it stunning thank you no let's go and see uh, the final installment of the wall of fame
I've got number 388 here. This is from uh, Janice Case. Hi to all at Joy Maker. Here's a moment here for this week's Wall of Fame. I've become a bit obsessed with making bracelet cuffs using chips and nuggets on gizmos and uh, and wanted to do one in gold, silver, copper and antique bronze. The chips and nuggets include opal, carnelian, agate, sorry, appetite, quartz, eyelight, etc, etc, etc. From the amazing 10 strand bundles you have done. All ingredients are from Joy Maker, of course. Uh, I was quite, it, it, it was quite therapeutic making these, apart from when some of the silver-coated pyrite beads wouldn't fit with the memory wire. Uh, would love to see them on screen. Regards, Janice. That's absolutely gorgeous. Stunning. Gorgeous. Best of luck. And this is 385. Oh, lovely. Uh, this is beautiful, isn't it? Uh, and you could do this with that kit we've just had. Those nuggets on there Ooh, would look you fabulous, could, yeah, absolutely. Uh, and this is from Lorraine. And Lorraine says, hello all at JM. Um, we have, how have you been with all this hot weather? My entry this week is a talk necklace, the flower I made uh, some time ago and didn't know what to do with it. Uh, this uh, is made from bronzite, large nuggets, green highlight uh, and smoky quartz drops with one millimeter bronze wire twisted. Uh, love my wire twister tool, highly recommended. Good luck to all on the wall of fame for this week and that's from Lorraine and that is absolutely beautiful. Yeah, it's my kind beautiful. of necklace. I love that. Yeah, it's stunning. Number 378, there's a load of amethyst in this. Wow. Sorry, 387. Um, here's my two for this week's Wall of Fame. This is from Jacqueline Walker, made with amethyst nuggets, and the cabochon is purple agate. Isn't that gorgeous? Best of luck to you, Jacqueline. That's absolutely gorgeous. Thank you. This is uh, 384. Oh, wow. Isn't that pretty? Lovely. 384, and this is from Joe, Joe Stewart. And Joe says, Hope you like my creation. A dream catcher for my baby niece, Evelyn May. Oh, oh cute. She's about 10 weeks old and is already becoming a diva. <laughs> I've used rose quartz for a soothing, loving energy and amethyst for protection. I'm training to become a crystal therapist, so know lots about crystals oh, wow. and their properties. Awesome. All the wiring gems are from JM, as is the wee star shell uh, in the centre. I'm hoping this piece will stay with my niece for many years. Uh, choosing spiral uh, designs over more childlike animal shapes. I love watching you all. You do make me laugh. Um, I nearly spat out my muesli when I switched on to see Vicky in the Christmas pudding jumper. Uh, poor love must have been roasting. I bet ah. she was. Yeah, I know, uh, yeah. Thanks for the great products and designs. Um, wish all the Wall of Fame is best of luck. Um, I look forward to visiting JM on the Sunday Experience on the 17th of August. Yay! Awesome. That's beautiful, isn't it? Well done, Joe. Brilliant. We'll see you then. Number 386. This is from Paula Thompson. Here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's made from quartzite flowers and JM uh, from JM with gold colour chain from one of the Jewelry Maker Findings kits with my earrings to match. Uh, looks very pretty when on. Good luck to everyone who's entered and keep up the good work. All the workers on Jewelry Maker do amazing. Uh, do an amazing job, and the show isn't. Uh, and the show is amazing value for money but also you're all very entertaining and keep us glued to the TV, including my husband, Liam, and granddaughter, Faith. You're all fab. Paula Thompson. Thanks, Paula. That's gorgeous. And beautiful um, set of jewelry there. Absolutely gorgeous. Coming up in just a few seconds, Ethiopian opal. What a treat. Oh, this is absolutely gorgeous. Genuine, natural Ethiopian opal. Coming up in a few seconds. guest designer Louise Jacobson for our Wirework Rings DVD. This DVD contains a step-by-step -step guide on how to use a ring mandrel, create single and double stone rings, cluster rings and much more. Get the inspiration and help you need to create your very own handmade jewellery. To get your hands on a copy, contact our call centre. Get creative with Jewellery Maker.
Join jewellery maker and guest designer Mark Smith for our long-awaited macrame workshop. Get to know the essential techniques and knotting formations to create these vastly popular designs. Learn square stitch, twist stitch, slip knot and much more. The full course includes a range of different threading materials, a selection of gemstones, use of all relevant tools, a buffet-style lunch and refreshments, a tour of the studios, a chance to meet the presenters and a visit to our Gemstone Museum. All of this for just $79.95. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewelry Maker, bringing out the designer in you. Do you know something? Um, if uh, if I if those details weren't on screen there, and this is the first time I'd ever seen this strand, I would definitely identify this as Ethiopian opal. This is like textbook Ethiopian opal. Um, the Wengal Tenor mines in Ethiopia are amongst some of the mo world's most famous mines for producing some of the world's most idyllic um, opal. Along with Kubipedi in Australia, those two locations, those two kind of mines are, are some of the most highly revered locations in the world to get opal from. But Kubipedi opal looks extremely different to Ethiopian opal from the Wengo Tenor mines. Um, Kubipedi opal tends to have a white body um, with um, play of colour, which is absolutely gorgeous. Whereas Ethiopian opal tends to have a creamier background, a more subtly coloured background. You're still going to be getting opalescence, but it's, it's much, much, much more subtle quality. Now, there are new gemstones being discovered all the time. Um, uh, there are new gemstones in the world that are being discovered all the time. Um, you've, got, you've got a few different locations in the world where you can get, um, where you can get beautiful gemstones like amethyst from, places like uh, Africa. And, um, and Brazil, and it really is, I don't think either, either location is better than the other. I think, I think you've got kind of fairly equal footing. For years and years and years though, the opal world was dominated by Cuba PD opal, by Australian opal. Um, and then in 2008, when this discovery of opal was unearthed in Ethiopia, it shook the opal world. It shook the gem world. So much so that people who had been fans of Cubipedi opal, who had hailed it as the gemstone, um, you know, linked with um, linked with Australia, you know, the absolute creme de la creme de la creme of opal, they were made to be quite nervous. Now, this incredible opal is mined on a pretty much a sheer cliff face. On a sheer cliff face, at the bottom of which, at the bottom of the ravine is the Blue Nile River, okay? It is extremely difficult to mine this gemstone. Lots of um, very, very simple mining techniques, lots of very, very simple tools being used to mine this incredible genuine gemstone. This isn't a mass, um, a mass mining operation a bit like uh, what you'd expect in the Minas Gerais region of Brazil. This is on a much, much, much smaller artisanal uh, level. The quality is, is absolutely superb. The location is almost impossible to get to 
unless you have some kind of mountaineering skills. In fact, that's where this gemstone comes from, that small area there, the Wengal Tenor Mines, on the side of a sheer cliff face. That's where this gemstone is mined. And literally, you're looking at, a, you're looking at an area, a belt, kind of a layer of ground and earth that's probably about that high and goes into the rock face, probably about four to six feet. Look, there you can see, a big dug into the mountainside, into the um, cliffside. And that is where the small deposits of opal comes from. Um, as you can see, it's a very, very, very small band of rock where this gemstone is mined. Uh, too high, too low, you're not gonna get any opal at all. You're just gonna get host rock, basically. Now, where this incredible quality gemstone comes from, unfortunately, is producing less and less and less of this incredible gemstone. There is less and less and less of this gemstone being discovered, and it's almost, in, it, it's almost entirely depleted. Many experts believe that Ethiopian opal might be totally depleted within the next three to five years. Um, and that worries me slightly. What also worries me slightly is the price point of this strand today. Because a strand of Ethiopian opal and, and almost all of the Ethiopian opal that I've bought you before on Jewelry Maker has been of a certain price point. It's been kind of 37.95, 47.95, those kind of price points. The deal you're getting today is under 30. It's under 20 pounds. And honestly, I think this might be one of the lowest priced, best quality strands of Ethiopian opal we've ever bought you. I think we have bought you Ethiopian opal, Ethiopian, op, Ethiopian, Ethiopian opal before that has been, uh, that has had more opalescence. However, I think carrot weight wise, I think overall quality wise and certainly price point wise, this has got to be one of the best deals we've ever, ever bought you. Under 18 pounds. Now, there are certain gemstones, opal being one of them, moonstone being another one, labradorite being another one, where you simply have to get the gemstone home. The lighting state that we have here is very, very artificial indeed. At the minute, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 13 lights pointing here and over at Janet. Most of the lights have got one, two, three, four strips in them. Okay, so that is dozens and dozens and dozens of lights pointing at us. It's very, very un, um, it's very, very artificial, the lighting state in here. Get this gemstone strand outside, get it home, get it into a natural lighting situation. Even, even the lights in your living room are more natural than the lights we've got going on here. That's the reason why I get so hot in the studio because of all the lights going on. So get this, get this strand home, get it outside, get it into a natural lighting state because you will be absolutely amazed. 17.95 and the great thing is a lot of you are multi-buying. If you do want to multi-buy a strand like this, get it home, see which one you like the most, send the other two back, you're more than welcome to do that. You're more than welcome to do that, no problem at all. I would advise you get more than one of these strands just purely because every strand is gonna be different. One might have more opalescence, one might have more of a creamy color background, but this is the opal which has changed the opal world forever. You've got a 30 day money back guarantee with an incredible strand like this. Get it home, have a look at it, try it out. See what kind of price points, see what kind of price points you uh, find elsewhere for genuine Ethiopian opal. I honestly think that's absolutely superb. Well done to all of you there, hold those lines, great deal. Gorgeous, right. How about, we are gonna get a chance to do the wire twisting pliers, aren't we? Yeah, 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 yeah. So we've got the wire coiling gizmo. This is the deluxe one. Um, because, oh, I don't know where that went, uh, because you are going to be getting loads and loads and loads of mandrels. Now, the original Y Corning Gizmo that we bought you gave you, I think it was two, two mandrels and just this bit on its own. Well, that's great, yeah, if you're going to be coining your Y, that's fantastic, but how are you going to attach it onto a onto a work surface, onto, uh, onto your kitchen table, onto your workbench. Okay, well you need a vise. This one's actually got the vise attached onto it. So you can attach it onto your workbench, onto your work surface, uh, and put your mandrels through there. Well, hang on a minute, there are loads and loads and loads of holes in this, rather than just two. Okay, it's because you are going to be getting all of 
EVs, amazing, wire coiling, gizmo mandrels. You are going to be getting five mandrels in total. Hold them there, just a, oh, it's a little bit, there you go, there, just so you can see them. Five mandrels in total. That is five different size coils you are going to be able to achieve using all of these mandrels. That is absolutely amazing. Plus the the um, the the um, device to hold it onto the uh, work surface. Plus, of course, the uh, cage to put your mandrels through. Now, all you literally do, and this literally is it is so simple, it's so easy. You get some wire, whatever gauge it may be. You wrap it around your mandrel a couple of times, anchor it, just kind of wrap it around this part as well. There's your handle, okay? You put it through the vise and you just turn. You just hold the wire um, in the other hand and you just turn and you can create the most beautiful pieces. Um, we've got so many guest designers who love using the wire coiling gizmo. Uh, the deluxe one that you've got here really is stunning and it is just that because you've got the vise as well as as well as the plate to hold it here and of course you've got five of your mandrels as well price point for this is astonishing and this is one of our fastest selling tools we've ever bought you seven pounds and 95p for the wire coining gizmo it's a deluxe one and it does come with instructions as well which is fantastic after a couple of times you're not going to need them though absolutely wonderful do we have a couple of pictures of the wire um of, of kind of the gizmo in action Let's see if we can find any we've got some examples of jewelry um, um if not Loads of you coming through to get this. Well done. Five mandrels in total. Everything you need, and take and and, and take advantage of the wire uh, that we uh, put on today's show as well. Take advantage of all that incredible wire. Here's the gizmo being used. Rachel Norris's uh, DVD using loads and loads of gizmo pieces, making her own clasps out of these as well. That's the gizmo in action there. The deluxe gizmo is very different, actually, to the first gizmo that we did, um, I isn't just it, Janet? Think I need to get that. I've got. I'm. Ju I've just used the other one, the the two, but that is much better because you've got the different size uh, mandrels. Yeah. Um, so you can do different different designs and and you got you've got the clamp with that, so you can clamp it onto your um, onto your desk. Yeah. So it's perfect. We've got. F there are five mandrels as part of this um, gizmo. And these are the kind of pieces you can make. You can make whatever you want out of these, but these are the kind of pieces you can make. Look at that, isn't that just delicious? I don't know who made that, that's absolutely beautiful. She's, um, whoever's made it has made all the links going up the neckline as well, knotted with it. Might be Rachel Norris, I don't know. It might be Karen Crawford, I know she likes the gizmo as well. I don't really know who made this. Do you know who made this, Janet? I don't, no. It's beautiful, isn't it? It is lovely. 7.95 there for your wire cording gizmo, your deluxe wire cording gizmo five different mandrels there absolutely gorgeous well done you've gone absolutely nuts over this it is it is the most amazing 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 tool it really is that necklace is absolutely delicious isn't it gorgeous uh, plus the vice plus um uh, the instructions as well which to be honest you're not really gonna need isn't that fantastic now okay i've got another deal now which is great with wire the wire twisting pliers i don't think i've i can't remember if i've ever bought these to you actually they are just it is, it is the most amazing, amazing, amazing tool. We bought you lots of wire in today's show. Um, we do have loads of you who participate in our games for wire. It seems to be the next logical step to move on to when you, um, when you do start your jewelry making hobby. You know, you start off with genuine gemstones, a lot of you, and then you move on to wire. This is amazing. This is the wire twister pliers these are absolutely amazing okay so this looks like a weapon of torture i understand that yeah these are your nine inch wire twisting pliers they are simple and easy to use in fact so much so um that you can go to our website jewelrymaker.com and watch a demo using this tool and you can also um you can uh, go to our youtube channel and see how to use this this is the demo so simple and easy to use so you get your two lots of wire. You can see it actually behind me. Can't you? There's your wire there. Hannah Osborne doing this. It will come with a voiceover as well. Okay, so you get your wire. There it is. She's still chatting and nattering away about something or other. I don't know what she's nattering about. Okay, so here they are. These are the big, heavy-duty, nine-inch wire twisting pliers. Um, I would advise that you have a look on the internet and see the kind of price points um, 
there are for these for this incredible nine inch dual because it is the most incredible price point that we offer you here here's your deal today for your nine inch wide twisting pliers 17 pounds and 95p the most amazing amazing price it really is incredible and this tool is designed to last it is seriously heavy duty it's designed to stand the test of time it is just awesome i love it it's amazing and seeing it in action as well seeing guest designers use it it is it is amazing it does it twists your wire in such a gorgeous and um, uniform way it really is absolutely superb love it love it love it love it love it love it well done so do go to our youtube channel and watch um and watch them on how to use this tool and also go to our uh, facebook sorry not our facebook page our website jewelrymaker.com and see how this tool is used because it is absolutely amazing and it gives your wire a really uniform professional twist all the way through whatever the gauge is fantastic next what's this contastic what's this then So it's a cone mandrel. Oh, whoa, this is awesome. Oh, I like it. So inside this little cylinder, you get all of these. Oh, how do I do that then? Do you just put the cone on top then? How do you do that? Oh, do you undo that with the Allen key? Oh, I like how this works. So you undo this with the Allen key. Am I undoing it or doing it up? I don't know. Oh no, I'm doing it up. There we go, here it is with Sarah Elwin by the look of it. Showing you how to use these. That's it, you undo it with the Allen key. I've never, then you slip that bit in there. Oh, nice. Then you get your wire, put your wire through the hole. There it is. And then you start to wrap your wire around and there you go, it's like a wax Y cone, but you're gonna be getting three, three of your cones in one tool with your Allen key as well. Here's your price point. How much is this one? See, that is brilliant. That is designed to last as well. A lot of you um, 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 who enjoy using your wire work pieces to create things like end caps and cones and bead caps, you will absolutely love this tool. And do you know what? It comes with instructions as well. Are they clear? Oh, yeah, it's pictures, light pictures. Yeah, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Fantastic tool. There are all of your instructions. They're your destructions. All in pictures, fantastic. Oh, they're in Spanish as well. Eee. So there you are, some more instructions on the back there. Just fantastic, so from say just one through to 10 of how to use this incredible tool. Uh, but you can go to our YouTube channel and watch this demo with Sarah Elvin. Isn't that awesome? Great tools. I tell you what, we do do some great tools, don't we? And all these tools are designed to save you time, designed to, um, 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 to save you energy, and to save you money as well, to save you wastage. Lovely tool, that one. Really fantastic. And the great thing about these, of course, is because um, if you might be buying this as a gift, um, they come with um, instructions. They do come with instructions. So if you are going to be buying it as a gift and the person who gets it isn't going to know how to use it, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because it comes with instructions. So let's say that again, love. Yeah. Yeah. Coming up in about two games time. Labradorite 95 sterling silver handmade chain. Woo woo! Can't wait to bring that, it's gonna be gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Here we go! Oh, we've been talking about this bundle before the show today. We said, when are we gonna do it? Dion said, I don't really know. Dion likes to bring out bundles like this as we head towards the end of the show. Yeah, bundles where it's obvious she just doesn't give a stuff, honestly. How about a strand of four millimetre rounds of gorgeous baby pink quartzite, dyed quartzite, baby pink, four mil in size. How about a strand of six mil baby pink quartzite? Yeah. How about a strand of eight mil baby pink quartzite? Four, six and eight mil strands of gorgeous rose pink quartzite. Looking good, looking absolutely gorgeous. Three strands in total, four, six, and eight millimeters in size. The great thing about having gemstones which are four, eight, and sorry, four, six, and eight millimeters in size is you've got gemstones perfect for rings, necklaces, bracelets, earrings, the lot. The price point for this is stupid. This was going to be the early bird today, but we don't have a big enough quantity. 
your price today is under 20 pounds is under 15 pounds is under a tenner here it is 6.95 for all three strands done done mm. That's beautiful, nice. aren't they? Nice colour, isn't it? They, um, they're Janet. amazing. Yeah. They're a really soft, watery sort of colour. Yeah. But yeah. water colours, you yeah. know, sort of That's like exactly Monet, what it is. pinky, watery colours. Water pink. lily colours. Yeah. They're, ah. They've got a really gorgeous colour to them. I like that. Ollie's saying a bit, it, it, it reminds me a little bit of a pastel coloured coral. Yes. Yeah, I'd go with that, yeah. definitely. Definitely a watercolour feature yeah. um, 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 to this bundle because, of course, you've got the three different shades. Ever such very, very delicately shaded strands of quartzite there. I think because quartzite isn't a, an opaque gemstone, but it's not transparent, it's kind of translucent. You get that bit of depth to this as well, so it does have a, like a, a, like a watercolour quality to it, doesn't it? They are like water lilies. They're just beautiful, aren't they? Loads of you with this in your baskets now. Well done. Do, uh, do, do check your baskets out. Well done. Six ninety five for all three strands there. Yeah. Like I said, this was going to be the only bit today, but we didn't have enough quantity. Yeah. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Lorna on the web. Love this so much. She's coming to get three of these. Please do multi buy. So is Anonymous, who's a web bidder, coming to get three loads. Well done. Loads of you still coming through to get this. Claire from Suffolk, two. Lots of phone bidders, well done. Isn't that great? Please do check your baskets out as quickly as you can. Gorgeous watercolour qualities here. It's a little bit brighter, a little bit more intense than rose quartz, don't you think? Yes, yeah. Yeah. But it's just an absolutely beautiful colour. Yeah. Stunning. And having the three sizes is really useful in the same Isn't it just? Stone. Yeah. It's like having three graduated strands, isn't it? Yeah. Well done. Beautiful. Definite bridesmaid jewellery. Zena from Greater London has got two lots. Z Jacqueline from Lincolnshire has got two lots. Mary from the West Midlands has got two lots. Well done, everyone. Loving that. Well done. Gorgeous. Next. Now, I have 47 of this next bundle. It is going to sell out. I'll tell you what, actually. Shall I... Shall we bring the graphics on screen and bring you the price without even showing you the bundle? Yeah? Three strands of pearls... 47 available, 9.95. £3.31 a strand of pearl. It's going to go. Blue, cream and silver pearls. It's going to go. 9.95 for three strands of pearls. Have we already got lots of people coming through on the web of the phone to this? <laughs> a couple of people. Not the kind of torrent I was expecting. 9.95. 9.95 for three strands of pearls. Do you want to see them? Here we go. You're all coming through now. Who cares what they look like? Who cares what they look like? Oh, they look a bit dodgy if I'm being honest. Oh, they look a bit dodgy. Do they look dodgy? No, they're absolutely beautiful. Look at them. Three strands of pearls for under £10. All I'm saying is it's going to go. Why are you putting this in your basket without checking your basket out? Because they're going to go, they're going to sell out and you're not going to be successful. Please check your baskets out. Please, 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 please. Well done. 32, 32, 32, 32, 11. What? 32, 13, 32, 11. Eight chances left. They're going to go, they're going to go. Yay, let's do it. Here we go. 95 sterling silver handmade chain with Labradorite. No dogs were harmed in the making of this strand. Labradorite. I tell you what, I thought my dog had eaten something dodgy last night. He was sitting next to me in the kitchen. His stomach was going bong. I thought, oh, he's eating something dodgy. No, I just hadn't fed him. Oh. I hadn't given him his dinner. That's why he was sitting so close to me. Max, what are you doing? Go away. He's like, please feed me. I'm only a doggy. I can't get my own biscuits. I fed him. Don't worry, I did feed him. Right, okay, you're getting at least a metre here. Whoever's measuring these is doing not doing a very good job because a metre, it's more like a metre and a half on this one. Anyway, my hyper-extending elbows. Um, you are definitely, 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 without a shadow of a doubt, going to be getting a metre, if not more, okay? It's all handmade. It's all 95 sterling silver. It's all got Labradorite on it. Okay, this one is going to be a pricey one, yeah? Yeah? Yeah. Because let's face it, You've got this length of chain, which used to be, what, around about 20 pounds when it was first launched, okay? Then we started to do lengths that were a little bit longer, say that long, 
about 30, 40 centimeters in length. That was about 20 pounds, yeah? Okay, well, you're getting a meter here. So that's three times the amount. Surely to goodness, this is gonna have to be knocking on what? 30, 40 pounds, yeah? Nowhere near. Each one of these links, I was talking to Maggie the other day, she's one of our guest designers, and, and, and she said that she worked out, it took about an, a minute per link if you're quick, if you know exactly what you're doing. Not to mention, there's gonna be loads of offcuts of wire which you're gonna waste if you're making your own. A minute per link, yeah? Shall I count? All oh, text messages coming through about this chain. From Michelle. I have this chain, it's lush. The Labrador Essence is amazing. Shelley from Hartlepool. Thank you. Thank you. That, yeah, that's absolutely awesome. Thank you very, very much for that. The Labrador Essence is amazing. And I haven't really kind of mentioned the gemstone yet because I'm so amazed by the price point we can offer you today for this. Surely to goodness, this has got to be between 30 and 40 pounds. Nowhere near. Today, under 20. 17 pounds 95p. Now you've got here, uh, two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 20, for 26, 28, 30. 30 there, so I'll just double that up roughly, and this is rough, yeah? That there, that's about an hour's worth of work there, if each link takes, an, um, if each link takes a minute to make. With no breaks. You've then got a couple of hours, two and a half hours there-ish, including that little bit on the end. Two and a half hours maybe of work, of solid work, or we can do it all for you for 17.95, with no wastage with no wastage because it is 95 stunning silver wire that you're going to be using here and if you were to make your own goodness me how many offcuts would you have how many little offcuts of wire would you have and they're all wrapped links that's the great thing about this because the wire is so fine and it is precious metal we understand it's going to be very very pliable okay so because the wire is so fine it's going to be particularly pliable but making just a closed link isn't going to sorry a, a, an open link isn't going to be enough. So each one of these has got an individual wrapped link. Can you see? On each one of these, the wrapped link. Those links can take such a long time to make. Judith, I bought the strand of sapphire like this in 925 Sunning Silver. It was valued at 250 pounds. Oh my word, really? Do you know, we have had loads of valuations recently. Fantastic valuations recently. And I'm not saying that this strand of Labradorite, when you, you know, if you want to get it independently valued, is going to be valued at 250 pounds. I'm not saying that at all. All I'm saying is the majority of people who get their jewelry independently valued are over the moon and astonished at the price points that they're valued at. They really, really honestly are. Beverly from Norfolk. Uh, I have tried, I'm about a meter, sorry, about a meter takes four and a half hours, Carol. This is brilliant value. Wow. Four and a half hours to recreate this chain or just pick up the phone <laughs> and dial the number and, you know. Or you don't need to do anything with this, Janet, do you? Just pop a clasp on it. You could just put a clasp on it. You could get a necklace, bracelet, uh, earrings. You, from that, you could get that. You don't even need to put a clasp on it because you no. could just literally... I, really, I, I do apologise if this bangs against my mic. You just literally pop it around your neckline like that. There we go. Like that done hasn't even got a clasp on it yeah if you haven't got a clasp you've just got a little tiny bit of silver wire just wrap the two end pieces together and you've got a long over your, over your head then yeah and you could yeah you could knot it um yeah you can make really simple pieces from it because all the work's done for you it's all done before for you. you even start yeah jewelry maker this should be called jewelry seller because we're just selling you a piece of jewelry really aren't we kind of ready made 36 opportunities remaining. Well done, all of you there. You're doing such a fantastic job today. Well done. Woo, woo. Which one? Yay, been waiting for this. I've been waiting for this gorgeous bundle. Is it going to ask the price that we discussed? Ready? One. Two. Three, multicolor quartzite plain rounds. All of these are six mil gemstones in size. They are all absolutely beautiful, aren't they? Yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Beautiful, multicolor quality. We are gonna go low. We are gonna go low. We are gonna go so low. In fact, we are going low, low. 
buffalo. Here's your deal. Boom. Yeah. Six pounds ninety-five p. Just do it. Yeah, those loom bands. The kids are going crazy for at the minute. These are the kind yeah. of colours of loom bands, aren't they? Yep. Yeah. Yes! What, what you could do then is, is get the, the kids to, if they're making loom bands, to so incorporate some gemstones into them. Yeah. And these would go perfectly with them, wouldn't they? I love these gemstones. They're perfect for the summer holidays, perfect to make those little stretchy bracelets out of, perfect to get your kids and your nieces and your nephews um, um, involved with making pieces of genuine gemstone jewellery. Well done. There is a bit of a queue on the phone lines at the moment. Please, 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 for the love of gemstones, check your baskets out. I've got about 20 of you with this in your basket. Please do check your basket out, otherwise you will miss out if quantity gets down to a certain point. Well done. Sharon and Sarah is coming to multi-buy this. So is Anonymous in Hampshire. So has Anonymous in Essex. Well done. So is uh, Najida in uh, Essex as well. Well done. You're doing brilliantly. Absolutely gorgeous. 6 95 for three strands of gorgeous multicolour quartzite. Do we... Uh, is this a great deal? Of quartz, of quartz it is. You're getting lots of colour here. Of quartz you are. Boom, boom. Sorry. Fine. Fine. Don't banish me to the workroom. Really. I'm going to banish you to the workroom, just like we have no, done with don't. Frankie. Frankie's in there. Oh, I'll be okay then. <gasps> oh, bam. 114 chances remaining in there. Well done. Loads and loads and loads of you coming through for this now. Well done. Rosalind in Northamptonshire is multi bought. So is, uh, so is, um, what's your name? June in East Riding of Yorkshire. So is Suzanne in Kent. So is Jean in Essex. So is uh, Barbara Ann in Suffolk. Well done to all of you there. All of you, loads of you multi buying. Well done. Less than 100 left. Less than 80 left. Someone's just texted in. Yeah! Sweeties, Sweeties, says Esther in the Valley of the Morgan. Sweeties! Yeah, definitely. Picky mix. Are you a sweet fan? Are you a sweetie fan? Mm. Are you? Yeah. Chocolate or sweets? Can you not tell? <laughs> Chocolate or sweets? Uh, both. Really? Yeah. What about Chocolate. you, Carrie? Chocolate or sweets? Chocolate. Chocolate or sweets, Dion? Sweets. Ollie, chocolate or sweets? Sweets. I'll go for chocolate. Only saying, so you're outnumbered, basically. Great, thanks. I know that these remind everyone of sweets. I'm all right. I'm not going to lie and say, oh, prefer sweets. If you want to send me some chocolate, I'd love some chocolate. Big chocolate bars. I like chocolate. Chili chocolate is my favourite. Oh, yeah. Uh, sweets covered in chalk. Look. Mm. Yeah, absolutely. Chocolate absolutely gorgeous well done isn't that awesome chocker chocker locker mocker which one yeah although my daughter at the minute isn't obsessed with chocolate she's obsessed with scrambled eggs honestly she i'm, I'm worried she's actually going to turn into a bowl of scrambled eggs she just she tries to see how much scrambled eggs she can get in her mouth at once it's just it's just incredible <laughs> She tries to see how much scrambled eggs she can get in her mouth all at once. Now, <laughs> here we go. Hair clips. Ah, Liam, this is for you. Oh, you haven't got any hair on top anymore. For your beard. Beard clips. Hair clips for your beard, why not? We shouldn't, we shouldn't alienate people if people got beards. I want to put clips in them, why not? Stranger things have happened. So, so what have we got here? Loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of clips. Now, you've got these gorgeous gold colored uh, hair slides, really nice long thin slides. Look at these, they're really, really nice. Ow! They're really strong as well. So you've got your hair, your gold colored hair slides, 10 of those, boom. Put those down there. Boom. You've then got your 10 hair slides in silver colour. So silver coloured hair slides. 10 of these. 10 of those. Boom. You've then got 10 of these. Wow, these are really, <sighs> these are really strong. 
That's, that, that's a good way of testing out if these are any good. <laughs> yeah, they're really good. They're really good. So we've got a hair clips. <laughs> I am actually insane. <laughs> Though I do, it's kind of like a, <laughs> but I can stop it at any minute. <gasps> Charlie bit my finger and it really hurts. Oh, I love that clip on YouTube. Ow, Charlie, that really hurts. Charlie bit my finger and it really hurts. <laughs> so you've got 30 hair clips here and hair slides. Um, 10 in the hair clips in the silver colored uh, quality. Um, 10 of the gold colored slides, 10 of the silver colored slides. Everyone's doing Charlie impressions. <laughs> it's your prize. I'm going to have to watch it after the show today. Go onto YouTube and type Charlie bit my finger. It's, it's one of the most watched clips on YouTube. Have you seen it, Janet? I haven't seen it. I will. So there's this little baby called Charlie who's got two teeth and his brother puts his finger in, his, um, puts his finger in Charlie's mouth and Charlie goes and bites it and, and the brother's going ha 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 and then he starts biting and he goes ha 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 Charlie oh Charlie and he gets his finger and Charlie goes ha and he goes Charlie bit my finger and it really hurts you can tell he's trying not to cry oh it's Aww. adorable I'm definitely going to have to watch that anyway eight ninety five for 30 hair clips and slide it's incredible well done loads and loads and loads of you coming through for this well done Helen uh, hi all, just bought these for my niece for Christmas. She will only be six in November. Well, I wanted to start early. Yes, absolutely. Get the making jewelry nice and early. Absolutely. And um, the great thing about these, of course, um, on a serious note, is you, can, is you can attach gemstones to these so, so easily. And um, you, uh, you can do, oh goodness me, what can't you do with these? They're absolutely gorgeous. You can uh, wire wrap gemstones onto them. Uh, you could put mesh onto them. You could put some polymer clay and, 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 and stick it onto these as well. You use the seed beads, decorate them with felt, decorate them with so many different qualities that we have here on Jewelry Maker. Well done, 30 of your hair clips and slides for less than nine pounds. Well done, absolutely awesome. And you've still got your 30 day money back guarantee and you're only paying 2.95 PNP per order. Well done, everyone. <laughs> oh, well done, everyone. See. Numero e doge is here. What's dos? Two. Ooh. Okay. Should we play a visit the visit the craft shop game? <laughs> Should we play the visit visiting the craft shop game? Yeah. Okay. Good game this one. Good game this one. Good game. Good game. Uh, so. You visit your local craft shop, yeah? You walk in. See how, notice how I didn't whistle then? Thank you. It's appreciated. Right? <laughs> and you walk in and you think, right, okay, all I want to get today are some, are some, are some earring findings. Uh, I want to get earring posts with butterfly backs, okay? That's all I want to get. You haven't got much time. You've got one of those free parking tickets, which, which lasts, what, 10, 15 minutes? That's it, you're like, I'm double parked, right. So you rush in. You pick up the earring findings from the, from the, what's that? That's a shelf. Here we go. <laughs> They're all laughing at my story already. Believe you and I, the punchline is fantastic. Uh, so you've got these earring posts with butterfly backs. These are wonderful. These are all yeah, God, Pick your favourite celebrity. Who's behind the till? Who's behind the till? Favourite celebrity or worst celebrity who scares the living daylights out of you? Joe Pasquale, mm. standing behind you, standing behind the counter. Standing behind the counter. I can't do a Joe Pasquale impression without offending everyone. Um, <laughs> so you've got uh, your butterfly earring posts with butterfly, uh, sorry, your earring posts with butterfly backs, okay? You are going to be getting 50 pairs, am I right in saying that? Yeah, 50 pairs of these. 50 pairs of these earring posts with butterfly backs, okay? You get the butterfly backs included, that's fantastic, okay? Now, the price point for this, can we do the price point? Is that okay? Yeah? So for 50 pairs of earring posts with butterfly backs in yellow gold plated copper, 12.95, yeah? Fantastic, absolutely amazing. You take them to the till. You take them to the till. Joe Pasquale is standing there behind the till. Uh, and, and he says, oh, no, I'm not going to do it. No, I'm not even going to attempt the voice. Um, 
they, he scans the barcode. Have you got a have you got a store card? No, I don't have a store card. Blah, blah, blah. And how much they are? The twelve ninety five. You get your money out. You haven't got much time. You get a free gift with these. Oh great. Oh great. Well, what is the free gift? The free gift's going to be what, like a sticker, or it's going to be, it's going to be a badge. I love, I love my local craft shop. I don't want a rubbish badge. I don't want a pencil charm. I don't want anything rubbish like that. No, no, no. The free gift's awesome. Honestly, trust me. I've got to find it. It goes under the desk. Oh, here it is. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Here's your free gift. What? 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 50 pairs of yellow gold plated copper shepherd's hook earring findings for free. How amazing is that? 50 pairs of these for free. For free. Earring findings are probably your most useful finding. Other than crimp beads, they're probably your most useful findings. To be able to bring you 50 pairs of earring posts with butterfly backs in yellow gold plated copper is absolutely astonishing. Yeah, yeah, okay. Then to give you a free gift of another 50 pairs of earring findings, um, yellow gold plated copper again, but this time Shepard took earring findings rather than earring posts with backs. That is absolutely amazing. That, I think that's probably the reason why many of you are actually multi buying this incredible deal. Earrings always seem to sell as well, don't they, Janet? Yeah, if you're doing a craft fair, well, Mark is always, is always saying, I mean, Mark has hundreds of pairs of earrings when he does a craft Guess fair. Guess it's on a Mark, yeah? Des Guess it's on a Mark, yeah. yeah. Um, and earrings, earrings and rings are, are always a big seller. Yeah. Absolutely. So it's always good to have a good not, selection. Not only that, but if you've got a couple of really nice strands of gemstones and you've used the majority of them to make a pendant or something like that, mm. and you've got a couple left over, yeah. it's a lovely way of making a really that's, attractive that's a really good uh, piece point, of jewellery. Yeah. You know, if you've got a couple left over, make a beautiful pair of earrings from them. Earrings are something which... Uh, earrings really do finish off... I was going to say something, but earrings, earrings, earrings that frame your face beautifully. They really, really do. And I notice sometimes, if I'm not wearing earrings, I notice there's something different about this going on here there's something different it's the fact that i'm not wearing earrings they just frame your face beautifully whether they're dangly earrings whether they're stud earrings they they always just seem to frame your face beautifully and um, especially if you've got shorter hair or you wear your hair up a lot they really do give such a beautiful feminine quality i don't know if you've noticed but um a lot of ladies who've got shorter hair tend to wear uh, more ornate earrings just purely because it, 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 it definitely adds that kind of feminine touch not only that but it just it just frames your face in a way that no other piece of jewelry can a necklace doesn't do it in the same way earrings always do it you'll notice the difference honestly if you don't wear earrings um, uh, very often mix it up wear some dangly earrings or some hoop earrings and, and just and you will absolutely notice the difference £12.95p for all of these it literally is buy 50 get another 50 free so it's not buy one, get one free. It's buy 50, get 50 free. I think it's just absolutely out of this world. It's stunning, isn't it? Yeah, great deal. Well done. Next. Which one? Amethyst. I go. Do, do, do. Here we go. So amethyst concave faceted gemstones. 10 on a strand. Both sides of this amethyst or of each one of these amethysts is concave faceted which is almost unheard of i've never come across a gemstone strand where this has been done before each side of the gemstone is concave faceted you're going to be getting this gorgeous silvery green quality across each one of these gemstones the whole strand 49.95 10 on each strand absolutely there they're about absolutely astonishing um beautiful quality you get that gorgeous kind of vanishing point when you look at these gemstones don't you and that's because of the concave faceting this is something which is normally only attributed with um gemstones set into very very high-end pieces of jewelry um definitely set with silver gold platinum just gorgeous if you made you know a pendant and earring set out of just three of these gemstones i think for a pendant and a pair of earrings you would have to charge minimum for all three pieces it would have to be 35, 40, um, uh, uh, 40 pounds just for three of the gemstones. It would have to be easily, easily, easily. Oh, they make great flowers as well, wouldn't they? <gasps> There's a centerpiece to a bridal, a bridal uh, boutique piece, maybe. Absolutely delicious. Gorgeous quality. Uh, next, 
the one step looper. Now, this is great if you're going to make your own gemstone chain. Have you used this one before, Janet? I have, yeah. Is it, is it, is it as easy as a one step looper? Is it easy to use? It's a one step looper. Really? Yeah. You just put your wire in, press handle, and it rolls it around. How amazing is that? This is great if you want to make your own eye pins. Unfortunately, with a lot of our findings packs, we don't supply um, a huge amount of eye pins. I don't know why, but 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 it's not something which um, it's not something which a lot of our most recent findings packs have got lots of. Um, so if you want to make so if you want to make your own um, um, eye pins, if you want to make your own eye pins, these are great. Not only that, you can make it out of whatever wire you want, whatever color wire you want, um, and you, you can make them pretty much whatever length you like as well. Okay, really, really simple and easy to use. Your one-step looping pliers come with instructions on the back as well. You're not going to need them. Here's a uh, here's a little demo on how to use these. Simple, literally, you put your wire through. Go on. Yes, 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 yes. We can all see that bit there. Go on. Go on. Push it together, push it together. It's because there's a voiceover as well on our YouTube channel. Come on, push them together. Yeah, I know, I'm holding it. Yeah, I'm doing that. Yeah. Come on, go on, go on, go on. She's going to do it, she's going to do it. Hey! Yeah. Take it out, take that one out. Let, let's the finish article. Oh, there we go, done. I'm taking the Mickey. But, uh, but yeah, out of. Um, out of all of our pliers, these are probably the most simple to use. Here's your price point for these. $24.95. We're going lower. We're going lower. We're going lower. For the one-step pliers. For the one-step pliers. They're easy to use. They're $18.95. They're not $24.95. They're $18.95. So get them right now. Add them to your order. Yeah, 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 yeah. Take it away, Janet. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ollie would say, go on, throw it to Janet, throw it to Janet. <laughs> Take it away, Janet. Thanks, uh, Ollie. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's fine. I would never, if you'd have gone, yo, 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 the one step lines are absolutely amazing, I'd have gone, Janet? Janet? <laughs> <laughs> I had to say yo, yo, yo on television. How old am I? <laughs> oh, I'm such a mother. Mother Hubbard. Right, so, £18.95p, well done, great deal. Sorry, sweetheart. Yeah, I've got it, uh, I think I've got it here. Great tool, this one, mini anvil. Now you love your wire work, Janet. How useful is a tool like the mini anvil or the dapping tool? Well, um it obviously depends what 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 sort of jewelry you're doing, but that's just perfect. That's that's great because it's small, and so if you're you going to a craft fair, you can sort of pop that in your in your craft bag, um, and you've got it there, so you can sort of make pieces and hammer away at the, at that, you know, and just draw attention to your store really. But it is really useful, as you say. It's portable. This one because yes. it's nice and small. It yeah. is really professional, isn't yeah. it as well? Yeah. Um, it's going to give you that really professional finish on your wire work pieces. Yeah, so you can hammer against it, you can shape on it. Um, yes. Yeah. Even if I'm right. a beginner, then I can use something like this. Yeah, yeah. And if you turn it over, that that sort of um, the curve at the bottom, you yeah. can use that to shape. Sorry, I'm sorry. This one's all wrapped up. There. Hasn't been prepared properly by my floor manager. <laughs> yes, Chloe. Uh, that was Cassie Don't. Blame Cassie, she's not here to defend herself, she's gone on holiday. Anyway, so that's a picture of it there. I haven't got time to unwrap it, I'm ever so sorry. There it is there. Here's your deal. Oh, thank you, lovey. Here it is. Chloe just pulled a face at me. Go, uh, uh, don't try and be nice to me now. There's so many politics in here. Politics. Here we go, fantastic. Well done, £8.95p. Right. Should we head over to the lovely, the delectable, Janet? Yes, let's do it. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, I've seized up a bit. Here we go. Janet, have you had fun with your challenge? It's been great, yeah. I've really enjoyed it. Oh, so what I wanted to do wow. is just sort of do lots of different ways of, um, the earrings were sort of a last minute thing because I didn't have much time to do too oh, much. Oh no, I think But the pink and the blue gorgeous. I thought looked really... Yeah, really striking. Yeah, really good together. Look at that! 
Isn't that gorgeous with the fuchsia? Why? They look great, don't they? Hands so off, Dion. That's just the point six with the with the spiral through the hole and then shape the earring hook from the one piece. Gorgeous. You've used easy, the easy. fuchsia wire again in this ring. I love this ring. It's just it, it sits beautifully across the rose quartz, doesn't it? Yep. Look at that. Isn't that stunning? Dion saying that's not. No, no, it's not. It's not blue. I oh, know, I just like it, she's saying. <laughs> That's nice. That does look a bit grumpy, that gemstone, don't you think? It looks like it has got a bit oh, of a frown going on there. Fair. I didn't think of that. I should have done it. Bit of falling out if I did it the other way. Oh. <laughs> but kind of cute. Kind of yeah. cute in an Easter Island way. <laughs> it's gorgeous. Look at that flower, isn't that beautiful? Oh, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? That translucent um, chalcedony is just amazing that against the wire, is isn't absolutely it? Stunning. Absolutely stunning. Gorgeous. And can we have another quick look at this one? Sorry, I didn't get a chance to look at this one. Oh, look at the back of that one. I just Ooh. did the little shape to stop it sort of dropping out of the back. Looks great. Lovely feature. That looks really lovely with the copper coloured wire as well. Isn't that beautiful? I like the fact you can still see that bit of detail at the bottom yes. of the mookite there because yeah. you haven't gone too mad with the wire work no. at the bottom there. Lovely. When are you next with us, Janet? Uh, oh, Friday. Oh, oh, tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow. night. Tomorrow night with Ali. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. Oh, Janet's going to be with you tomorrow evening. That's going to be brilliant. When am I next with you? I don't know. I think I'm with you on Monday. Too soon. Too soon. Thanks, Chloe. <laughs> I tell you what, I don't know what I've done today. Everyone seems, there's a lot of Aww. hate. A lot of hate in this room today. Not really. It's always full of love. Beverly in Norfolk. That is one beautiful frowny amethyst. Well done, <laughs> Janet. Love these designs. <laughs> Stunning. Thank you. Thank you so much for being with us today, Janet. It's been an absolute pleasure, as usual. It. Thank you. As usual. Um, I think I'm with you on Monday. Monday, yeah. But please do tune in for um, our, our, our designer inspiration show today and the late show because they've both got at least five clearance deals on each show. It's seriously, it's going to be crazy. We've got Frankie with the lovely Becky today as well, which is going to be absolutely wonderful. 14 95 for this challenge bundle if you want to come and get the ultimate wire bundle uh, with loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of wire. In fact, all the wire that you can see that Janet's used here which is just gorgeous. Um, thank you very much for joining us today. It's been no, brilliant, it's been as great. usual. So much fun with Janet. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Uh, great deals coming up in the Designer Inspiration Show. Don't go anywhere. Uh, you want to tune in to see Frankie and Becky. See you in a bit, guys. Take care. Bye.